Let's get this shit started. Hello, welcome back to the world. On my name is Beast, and I'm back. Da 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 da. Hello, Mike. My name is Beast, and I'm back with Saku Saku. I decided to record more of this because I can. So yeah, basically I decided, hey, it's a weekend recording and it's only like two hours, so uh, that's not enough. So here come three hours of Saku Saku probably, because I don't know how to hold myself back. <laughs> As I heard something that happened on Friday, well, uh, yesterday basically. After I was done with the Miyabi recording, I uh, basically joined back in uh, Scott's stream, uh, Bosk War. And basically, at some point, we started talking about. Uh, uh, at the end, he talked uh, was talking about how soon they're gonna like f uh, finally go for the first route. And they mentioned I like. I mean, I Beast is already done with it, so he knows what's happening. And he like starts talking about like. I mean, like he does like six hour parts sometimes. So I guess. it was just like, like I don't know how you do this. And my re response was just like willpower and ADHD. <laughs> Anyways, uh, listen to Sempa's request. I guess I have no choice but the man up here. Which, by the way, uh, uh, I do actually join in on his XCOM streams every now uh, I do try to join in on his XCOM streams frequently because, uh, here's the thing. Uh, I'm a character in his XCOM game. I'm a giant fuck-off robot is what I'm trying to say. So, uh, that's nice. Uh, <laughs> And I think I let out my most raw, powerful sentence while I was watching that stream. Mainly <laughs> because uh, there was a level where the cho chosen assassin showed up. And I just really wanted my character to punch her. So basically what I said was, I'm going to punch her in the face so hard she's going to lose her third dimension. <laughs> And something about that, like, like I literally just randomly thought of that and sent it out, and then I only realized that is a very powerful sentence, and I need to use that more. <laughs> like I thought of it, I need to use it. Anyway, so yeah, I guess I have no choice but to man up here. So, what is your request? Oh, yatta, Yuma kun tsureta. Okay, let me decline after all. Behind you? Well, I remain puzzled as to what she's actually, uh, what she actually wants from me. Uh, she has already turned her back to me before I even moved uh, so much as a finger. Besides your shoulders? And why does this have to be me? I think So could do that just as well. I'm just saying there's no difference between us, right, Senpai? Seeking for consent, I direct my gaze towards her. But for some reason, her answer betrays my expectation. <laughs> just, just smile through the pain, my man. Just smile through the pain. Too bad that uh, your pain expression is like halfway cut off by my face. Also, I like have the fucking sensor set up like this from the goddamn Bitsy Demons recording. <laughs> Don't ask why. And yes, these are the timestamps for today's video. I managed to only have to do three. So that's nice. Anyways, uh. Sure doesn't sound like you're hurt though. As I approach Senpai's back while letting out a sigh, so takes his leave with a grin on his face. Just. That plainly says, good luck, bro. Consequently, that means I'm alone with Senpai right now. Well, as requested, I'll massage your shoulders then. Oh, yatta! Uh, yeah, it seems she's been all set to have me do it from the beginning, so it's probably futile to muster any resistance at this point. Oh, my chest hurts. I resign myself to my fate and reach my hands out towards Senpai's shoulders. I mean, there's two choices. He's either gonna suck what he's gonna be, or he's gonna be really good at massages. But we all know, he may, even if he's good at massages, 
He's never going to reach Hiroshi levels. So yeah, the poor bastard. <laughs> my fingers come to contact with her wet shoulders. And then I put some strength into gripping them with my fingertips. <laughs> Hold on a second. Shoulders are pretty stiff. <laughs> Do a lot of desk work after all, your sitting posture may be bad. So <laughs> Every time I need her shoulders, she lets out her alluring moans. Most likely because of that sexiness she inhibits, I can't help but I vividly sense her skin that's sticking to my fingers. What the hell am I thinking? Letting out a sigh, I weaken my grip again. <sighs> Do you feel sorry for what you said? What would you do if I did it for real? You should act more prudent in matters concerning your own body, at least. I pretend that I didn't hear that, muttering, her ba muttering that and continue massaging her shoulders. But anyhow, I feel that her shoulders aren't as stiff as before anymore. Probably means that gripping her as strongly as I did just now actually bore fruit. If you say something weird again, I'll grip you with even more strength than before. Then I'll listen, what is it? That's hard to answer. I mean, it's only been two days since I joined. It probably only feels so long because recently I didn't miss out on any op uh, you didn't miss out on any opportunity to pester me, didn't, don't you? Don't you think? <laughs> Talking aside. <laughs> I continue kneading her shoulders without any conversation going on between us for a while. The stiffness in her shoulders has now dissipated and the frequency of her luring moans has also gone down considerably. At that point, I abruptly raised my voice again. Thanks for the day. Oh? I had a lot of fun today, so I thought I should use this opportunity to thank you. The reason for doing it doesn't matter. The re result is still the same. I had fun as well. I'm not lay lying. These are my true feelings. But... What do you mean? Having mm. set that set by distances herself from me. Mm. Then she makes a rapid turn and heads, he, he, heads back towards the pool. So it's just like she said, the day is still young. Still more fun waiting for us. 
We enjoyed romping around at the pool until we were completely exhausted, and then we went to have lunch at the school cafeteria. After that, we continued the welcoming party in the student council room. Near the end of the day, we got excited over a board game that Senpai had unnoticedly smuggled into the student council room at some point. Needless to say, she got scolded by Tsukushima for having something like that at the student council. <sighs> Keep saying romp. あ、ねえ、ゆりちゃん。この前言ってたお店だけど。Oh, also, there's like, like just a picture of my sister just in the chat uh, chat with, that I text my brother with just now because my back, chest hurts so I need someone to press bat on my back again. But the motherfucker was in the middle of goddamn game of Overwatch that he literally just started so he couldn't and my mother doesn't have enough strength to do it. So yeah. Basically, there's also a picture of my little sister I randomly took because she was like petting the cat and her hair was like all over her face and somehow she didn't fucking notice it. So I decided like, at first I pointed at her face and she was just looks at me com completely confused. So I decided to just take a picture and show her. Upon which she just shot up and started screaming, screaming DELETE IT! <laughs> just like DELETE IT! DELETE IT! So of course I sent it to both my mother and my brother because screaming at me to delete it like that is just basically telling me to send it to people I know. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I did. Anyways. So I ended up casually walking one step behind everyone. Then, while staring at the, sky, at the sky across the windows, I reminisce about the rich days of the past weeks. And I think about it, a lot of things happened since the opening ceremony. What remains especially vivid in my memories is... Uh, Dinpo, huh. Walking behind her, I throw glimpses at her back. Like things like fussing... Like fusing a club with the student council. She gives the impression of someone who just does whatever she wants, but uh... She also has a strange charm that makes you forgive her for her unreasonable actions. Particularly related to me would be the wanted poster case. I don't know why. Before I knew it, I'd stopped caring about it. Since the very person I'm currently thinking about suddenly addresses me, I ended up getting a bit startled. No, not really. Oh yeah, there's something I've been thinking about. That's right, I've been thinking about you. Nante. <laughs> I've been thinking about it back upon the past few two weeks. Like I got the bounty on me thanks to you. Nanda, First you complain that I don't act sweet enough, and now you're surprised when I supposedly do act sweet. Interesting, so I've become your capturing target before I knew it, good to know. Yeah, I'll wait with minimum expectations. With a sour look on her face, she complains about my answer. Alright, let me clarify before I forget it. Can I take it that you still want me to be part of the student council? Okay, thanks. Please keep it to a level that won't make me run away. Don't know, it's my first time doing this kind of activity, so I can't tell. So, if you're going to 
Yeah, that will make double sure that ne to, to never ever cry before you. Well, we continue this now, by now, already typical exchange for us. We leave the school behind us. After school, a short while had already passed since we started with today's student council activities. はい、はい、お疲れ様。えっと、じゃあ次は何をしてもらおうかな。あ、そんじゃあ俺の作業を作っ。やっか。え、何ですか。小江田君はさっきからサボりすぎ。他の人を見習ってキリキリ働きなさ
I just read smugness instead of snugness. Clinging to the plushie that represents some enigmatic life form, she rubs her face and body against it like a smitten cat, while she fondles its fur in a transforming and enraptured expression. She somewhat seems, um, ecstatic to a degree you might think she's a person best put behind bars. Unexpectedly, you unexpectedly, you unexpectedly fond of cute things, I reckon. Do you also pet plushies like her? So you do have plushies. Calling it bizarre is going a bit too far, I think. <laughs> Again, maybe it fits her just maybe it fits just right. But anyways, how should I put it? Uh, the way she moves her hand as she caresses her plushie looks strangely love. Lashivous in my eyes? I don't fucking know how to say that. Well whatever, there's no harm in it as long as her target is just a plushie. Let's just leave her alone. Yeah, by the way, why are these even in the student council room? Do they all belong to her? Knowing Senpai who continues to snuggle her plush toy for now, I ask Soul, who seems to be the one who most likely knows. By the way, uh, somebody schooled me last part. About. Okay, we get it, we get it, we get it. Someone schooled me last part on which fuck's Let's up this to like 60. Because somebody schooled me last part on the fact that uh, the text box turns blue if another character is, if we're seeing things from another character's perspective. But I was just too retarded to actually notice. So that's nice. Anyways. Let's see. Like, there are quite a lot of them, and on top of that, the one she's clinging to right now must have cost quite a lot. Simple terms, it means uh, terms, it means that it just means that many people occasionally express that much gratitude towards her. I suppose a lot of students adore her as the student council president. That's something that's rather hard to believe if you see her like this though. As I shift my gaze back towards Senpai, who is yet to stop caressing and tickling her plushie. Uh -huh. Uh, <laughs> accompanied by a sound of ripping fabric, the ears of the plushie Senpai has been fiddling with has come off. Again? Did you just say again? Is <laughs> and now what? I imagine it was pretty expensive. <sighs> Fix it? You mean have someone you can, who can do that? Let's see, but isn't it quite a bother to that person if you come by at a monthly basis to have it fixed? <sighs> Quite a characteristic of her, she actually seems dejected. It would seem that maybe even she has someone who's bad at dealing with... She, she's bad at dealing with. After that, we've finished up some more tasks, followed by a couple of games of Shogi. Followed by, followed by a couple of games of Shogi. Then? Shogi still doesn't make sense to me. <sighs> Senpai's announcement heralded, heralded the end of the day of today's student council activities. Na na, Yuma. Mada hayashi, geisen demo ikane? Seito kai yakuin ga seifuku no mama souyu tokoro ni ikanai de kudasai. Yabe. Koeta kun wa mou sukoshi seito kai yakuin toshite no jikaku o motte kudasai. And he's gone. <laughs> Ahahaha! <laughs> so, so, 
I doubt he'll hang around somewhere instead of going home after everything you said, so that shouldn't exactly be a problem, right? She still seems to be a little disgruntled, perhaps because she didn't get to say everything she wanted to say. That was my plan, you don't want me to? せっかくだからスーパーに寄ってお買い物でもと思ったけど。バッ。ふきんさんに怒られそうだから一旦家に帰るね。ご飯の買い物くらいなら別にいいんじゃないかしら。ならよかったです。The <笑> fact the fact that we won't be going straight home doesn't change, but self-evidently, swinging by a game center and going to a supermarket aren't exactly the same. Alright, let's not waste any more times, if we're also gonna drop by the supermarket. Uh, senpai, see you tomorrow! Having exchanged goodbyes, we left the student council room. Oh no, I seem to have forgotten my bag. With everyone gone, I expect the room to check whether all the windows are properly locked. As I contemplate about what to do tomorrow, I run my gaze over the table. There's something of a, like a bifold wallet where Yuma was sitting today. Actually, it really is, without a shred of a doubt, a wallet. Any right, leaving your wallet at school is quite the stunt. But if I run, I might still be able to catch up. Take the water and hurriedly finish the remaining cleanup. On the way home with Mio and Konami, as we just reached the bridge. I hear an all too familiar voice coupled with the pitter patter sound of approaching footsteps. <laughs> Tina? Did you come to pick us up? Hi! Ah, so she got bored and just aimlessly strolled through town, huh? Well, I suppose it's better than lazily napping the whole day at the very least. あ、ちょっと寄っていこうかな。寄り道はユーリ先輩に怒られますよ。うあ、そうだったね。今日は我慢する。ところであの、今日はミャオさんもコナミさんもご一緒なんですね。Well, duh, as you can see, what of it? ミヤリ、私知っていますよ。一緒に下校は恋人同士の定番です。there you go again. Listen, how could you even think that? We merely left the school at the same time. Don't take everything she says seriously. Why in the world did you do you, where in the world do you even learn that kind of stuff? Anyways, we get it all got it all wrong. Would you keep quiet for a second? I should always want, the, uh, want to make things more compl complicated. もう、お二人と付き合っちゃえばいいと思います。ユーマさんが相手では恋の要請ができません。ひなさんは兄さんに恋人を作りたいの？はい、恋の要請ですから。コナミさん、ミャオさん、ユーマさんをお願いします。は
Don't you go along with her cat swallow. Come on, let's go. You're no candidate. I don't need my own sister as a girlfriend candidate. So this. Yeah, yeah, I get your point already. Anyways, let's not waste any more time here. Mio, you... Uh, Mio? Let's go, Tina. Konami. Since Tina joined in as well, the pr this promises to become a this promises to become a rather breezy trip home. Then On shows up. Oh,追いかけてきてみれば、なんともまあ意外なところに、うんうん、偶然ってわけでもないのかな。<laughs> that day at night, after dinner, I was in my room for a while to do ho my homework. When I was all done, I left my room in order to take a bath, but then... Huh? That time I hear the front door open. It was Konami who came in and took off his shoes. Where have you been at this time? Konbini. You could've... You could've... I could've given you some of mine, you know? I thought I was going to do it, but... I was a little tired, so I was good for myself. Can't say I don't comprehend getting the urge to breathe, breathe some fresh air when getting stuck while studying, but still... Don't do that alone, at the very least. It's dangerous for a girl to walk around outside by herself at this time. Contrary to my expectations, Konami drops her, drops her shoulders and heaves a sigh. Did something happen? What? Konami, are you okay? Did he do something to you? I see, you gave me a start. So, uh, you're saying it was some perverted woman? Basically a female molester? That's pretty ambiguous. Okay? That's an unusually precise explanation coming from Konami. Due to that, I find myself unable to get a, clear, to get a clear image. You haven't reported it to police yet, right? Shall I? So... Uh, Konami, looks like something is bugging her as, uh, as she seems to ponder about something. Huh? Senpai? Whoops. Fuck. Uh, go ahead. Finish. Which is it now? Let's see. Well, it wouldn't really make sense for Senpai to loiter around here in this at this time. In the end, Konami apparently also concluded that it must have been just- it must have just been her imagination. Gotcha, I don't go outside alone at night anymore, okay? Yeah, anytime. So Konami stalks off back to her room while I head to the bathroom. あ、
、良い知らせを寝て待つしかありません。ティナ様にも困ったものでございますね。After school, just like yesterday, we're zealously engaging in paperwork. She's gonna be strangely tired. By the way, Semper. Huh? Atashi? Nani, nani? Short while after we saw Mio off to go and maintain the flower bed again, I call out to Semper. I hear you held on to my wallet. Ah, uh, uh. Asa, Yuri, ni watashite o i t a n d a k e d o c h a n t o u k e t o r e t a n d a Yeah, thank you. I only thought I'd have to make do without lunch today. そっかそっかもう忘れちゃダメだよ I really need to be careful more, I really need to be more careful from now on According to what Tsukushima told me I apparently left it right on the table and around where I'd been sitting yesterday Huh? Huh? See that plushie is already fixed ぬいぐるみおおパニャちゃんのこと So that gigantic enigmatic peach creature is パニャ Well, not that I care about its name anyway. Anyhow, at first glance, there is absolutely no trace of damage from when the ear was ripped off yesterday, which is a little bit surprising. Leno, Saiho no Tokui no Tomodachi ga, Hitoban de yatte kure tano. The friend is pretty skilled. Hmm, Kanari de Kiruko da kara ne. Chotto, Kokan Joken ga mendo nan da kedo. Kokan Joken? Nani ka yokyu sare te runska? まあちょっとねあんまり気が乗らないお仕事をせかされるというか何のお仕事かは知りませんけどせかされなくてもちゃんとやってくださいうん分かってるよ本当にユーリもあの子もお説教ばっかりなんだからつまりそのお知り合いはユーリ先輩みたいな気まっ口うるさいところ以外はあんまり似てないけどねつまりそのお知り合いはユーリ先輩みたいな気まじめタイプなんですね。I just really want him to want you to suddenly go like, oh, by the way, call on me. Like, we, you haven't like encountered that female pervert from yesterday anymore, right? Like, everyone's like, what? Huh? What? <laughs> like, someone's like, female pervert? Yuri, that's. Are, are you okay? And a n n a s just over there, like, fuck! Yeah, that was like apparent, like apparently while out going out to the convenience store to got buy some lead for her pencils, she like saw some woman that was basically ru running around in underwear. I was really weird. Like the, 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 the explanation sounded really weird. And I was just looking up in the background. Fuck! Because I, I, I bet that was actually on. <laughs> The mind of Tsukushima, she's the one who brings the nagging upon herself. So, 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 Huh? Huh? Ho ho! In response to Senpai's ultra abrupt utterance, Tsukushima is totally startled, so breaks into a grin, and. Wait, did they just readily believe what you just said? Where in the world did you hear that unfounded rumor? <laughs> But it appears that she has no intention of revealing her source of information. So, what is it? 小さい女の子と同棲しているって噂を聞いたんだけど。Living together. Are you talking about Tina? うーん。Tina ちゃんって言うんだ。うん、で、どういうご関係 ?She's just living in our place due to, due, to, due to some circumstances. それじゃあ、実は小さい子が好きなんだってことは ?That's absolutely wrong. I decisively denied with a straight face that leaves no room for any sort of misunderstanding. But, Nisan, you're not going to be able to get the money. What? 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 What?
is it is deeply troubling to have a sister skinny as there. えっと、ということはつまり事実なの。おそばく。もしかして本当に。ドリコン疑惑は深まる一方ですな。でも俺は優馬が小さい子しか愛せなくても友達でいてやるぜ。なお、正式に正式に。ん。ザペスタンリーズアフォイスアンドアフィアトリカルトゥ。僕の発言を許可しますどんな素敵な言い訳を聞かせてくれるのかなウォルピアダラウォスポロントライアルバファリーライズダットエニオイトミンスダ
Oh wait, neutrally. For his neutral special, he wields a gun! <laughs> Tsukushima's lecture promises to become slightly longish today. At day at night. What's this all of a sudden? To take a short break from doing homework, I left my room to get myself a cup of coffee. It was at that point that I always suddenly appeared half in tears. <laughs> that would make for a rather bland lunch, I guess. You already talk as if there was there, as if there was no helping it. You just need soy sauce, right? I'll swing by the convenience store. Well, um, I suddenly remember the fact that Konami apparently met some pervert yesterday. I can't possibly have a woman go outside at th this late hour. Leave it to me. I'm not a child anymore. I'll be just fine by myself. <laughs> of course I do. Seems I made her acquire some weight, but as in standing doesn't matter though, I guess. Let's get going then! I left for the convenience store, bought the soy sauce, and while I was at it, some ice cream as well, then set off for home. As I followed the road home with a plastic bag dangling from my hand, I reached the proximity of our house. Supposedly there was some pervert who loitered around here last night. It weighed a bit on my mind, just to be sure I surveyed the area. A suspicious person around. <laughs> Spot a person who induces a spill of discomfort. A woman clad in an extremely revealing black dress. Cosplay, I guess? As my personal impression surfaces in my mind, I recall the fact that Konami described something similar yesterday. Our house is just a few steps away. If it really is a pervert, that's pretty bad. Hey you there, what are you doing here at this time? I call out to her. As I call out to her, the woman in, black dre in the black dress slowly turns towards me. Mm. What? The instant I see her face, my mind freezes over for a moment. Just like Konami mentioned, she really does look a lot like Zempa in some way, but uh, at the same time, also somewhat different? Kisamago. Asaba Yumako. Put some clothes on. Huh? Did she just say Asabiyuma? Why does she know my name? But judging from the fact that she wanted to confirm my identity, the possibility that she was actually Senpa in a costume, cos, uh, cos, costume, co cosplay costume was thereby ruled out. But uh, still, from her hairdo to her face and figure, the more I look, the more I can't help but think that they look alike. Well, whatever the case, there's nothing more striking than that right now. Indeed, a pervert to a T! Uh, well, damn it, I accidentally said what I was, th what I was thinking aloud. What's already said can't be taken back. I'll just soldier on and cut off the reservations and speak bluntly. What else do you call someone who walks around outside while wearing exhibitionistic clothes like that? Good. So, I, so you are at least self-aware that you're a pervert. I'm not mocking you. I'm just confirming the facts. You're an exhibitionist, right? Well, I can't really think of any other reason why someone would walk around in that attire at night. ほろかなやつめ。この昨日日を理解できぬとはな。そもそも。ほら。俺だ。かっこいいだろ。ほら。俺だ。かっこいいだろ。あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ
どいつもこいつもこんな男の何がいいというのだ Hey, I don't have a clue what you're talking about, but I don't think some pervert I just met for the first time has any right to talk crap about me. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with calling a pervert a pervert? <laughs> Go ahead and try if you can! Now that it has come to this, it's already tit for tat. However. <laughs> そこまで言うなら望み通りにしてやろう。Woman's gaze increases in sharpness at that. What? With a shiver, an instinctive fear runs through my back. Eh? I just like, I just really want to, I want to just see the fucking scythe. Ah! Reaper! <laughs> Just when I thought I sensed the gust of lukewarm wind, the next moment black wings have sprouted from her back. Blowing that, she swings a large scythe with a fluid slow motion. Don't tell me. You're a reaper? Her? Shelter, there's only one person who I know who can be tied to those keywords. Don't tell me she's. I'll be straight up. We've heard this voice before. Talk to An. She looks like An. And they already knew about her existence because of something I did back before I made my Discord server. Bas uh, and it was basically while I was play playing Ascendant and Banka, actually, where we, for some reason, decided to play uh, Aura Kingdom and make all the care, like me and some, uh, me, Storm, and some other people. Tony wanted to join as well, but his PC didn't fucking want to uninstall uh, Aura Kingdom for some reason. Basically, we just decided, ah, yes, we're just going to make visual novel uh, uh, our characters. To just design our characters after visual novel characters. I decided to make Yoshino, Tony was gonna make Mako, and Storm decided to make her, Eleonora. So I already knew about her existence. <laughs> no, I knew it's right here because of Tina. I just really don't want to just let go, like, fucking get, come at me then. And just the moment she tries to swing, fucking Hyperion just come in. Leave my boy toy alone! <laughs> in contrast to her words, the Reaper has introduced herself as who has introduced herself as Eleonora menacingly branches the sharp scythe in her hand. I suppose that basically means, uh, but if you don't listen, then. At the same time, it would be really funny if you know, just walked up to her, just looked at the scythe, just snatched it away, just chucked it away, chucked it off into the fucking distance. I click my tongue in my mind and forcibly transform the feelings that almost make me tremble in fear into irritation. I refuse, she's not some sort of pet like hell I could just readily hand her over to you. Don't make me repeat myself, I refuse. Oh. Channing all the will I can muster, I continue to glare back at her as if to convey that I won't budge. <laughs> something tells me that you'll actually try to swing at him, but something protects him. I don't know what crossed her mind, but she loosens her posture. My reply won't change no matter how many days you give me. I just said my answer won't change. I will never hand her over to someone like you.
Having just one sidely thrown her demands at me, she disappears as if melting into the darkness. Not figuratively, figuratively, she really did disappear from the spot she had been standing at. Damn it. She really causes nothing but trouble, that girl. However, there is no way I could hand Tina over to someone like her who suddenly pops up and launches threats. I'm not just clear, but what do I do? What should I do? Is it going to work out somehow with Kotaro's help, like the time with when Hiberian showed up? <laughs> While I get ready for school, Tina crawls out of my bed, sleepily running, rubbing her her eyes. As for why she was sleeping in my room in my bed, that's because she once again slipped inside while I was in the land of dreams. It's still very early, so if you don't didn't have enough sleep just yet, you can sleep for some more. <sighs> With unchangingly drowsy eyes, Tina returns inside my bed. I just really wanted to look outside. Eleanor is just out there. He just opens his, his window, just grabs the plant there, just chucks it at her. Leave! I, 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 basically, I just don't want him to actually treat her like a threat, but just a mild nuisance. That would be actually hilarious. Like, even if his life is actually in danger and he would actually die if she swung at him, unlike what, with what I'm assuming is gonna happen, that the fact that, like, I'm my, my theory right now, like, the only thing I knew about this game is Eleonora. That's all I knew, and f I watched the opening accidentally, so I'm pretty sure Ann and Eleonora share a body. I'm not 100% sure, though. That's all I know about this game, so anything else is speculation, basically. And, basically, my, my speculation is that the soul he has, the, the life he has, is actually the life of that soul reaper. Either that, uh, either that soul reaper is Tina's sister, or somehow Tina gave a, her, a part of her life, and that made her regress like that. Either or. I'm betting more like it's actually someone she used to know. And then she vanished, and that's actually the person who talked about love a lot. That Tina talked about at the start. Or something like that. And, uh, Basically, basically part, uh, point is, the life he carries in his chest right now is, uh, basically that of a soul reaper. So when she actively tries to attack it, the fact that, like, there's gonna be something where soul reapers cannot actively harm each other, or some, bu some bullshit like that. So it's somehow that's gonna actively protect him. Like, soul re the reapers cannot kill each other, is basically what I'm going to guess. With unchanging, he draws your eyes, Tina returns inside my bed. Well then, after I've tucked uh, in Tina, who went back to sleep, I quickly finished changing and get ready to leave. Yuma-sama. Well, yeah. Oh, so you've been here too. Kotaro had been left in the le corner of the room, so he gets up and wobbly floats over to me. Yeah, something's happened. When I throw that vague reply at him, I ruminate on the fact that it may just be the perfect opportunity to consult him since Tina is asleep, asleep again. I want to avoid making Tina feel anxious as if. If I, if I can, so I haven't talked about last night's event with anyone yet. Hey, Kotro, there's something I want to ask you about. Just as I was about to ask him about that soul reaper called Eleonora. So, so, Yuma-sama. Watakushi, konya wa odekake itashimasu no de. Huh? Deskara, fuzai ni itashimasu. Go yoji ga atte mo hiki uke rare masen no de. Ashikarazu de gozaimasu. Uh, hold on a second. The night's exactly when my deadline to hand over Tina is. If something's, you, if it's something you can put off, I'd want you to. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> you know about that? Oh yeah. I'm sure everything knows about that Soul Reaper as, as well as what she's demanding from me. And under that premise, he's declaring that he won't be able to help like he did when that pansy Soul Reaper showed up. You. Damn, I don't know about their circumstances, but it seems I can't count on them. That said, it's not like there's anyone else I can ask for help. Well, there's still something I need to check on. I'll check on if I can say that for sure. 
I muttered that inside my mind, then proceeded to check up my, pick up my textbook stuffed school bag. I have something to do before class starts. I just really want I just, like he just Kotaro just says that uh, us, uh, like Yuma just looks at him listen if you want to smack you could just come over here and say it tell, tell me <laughs> seen off by rather suggestive seeming Kotaro I leave my room early in the morning I gave notice to Aoi, then set off for school without eating breakfast. I was continuing to think about what I should do while my legs advanced further my, towards my destination. Advanced towards my destination without further. I can't get that out of my head. <coughs> that soul reaper from last night who introduced herself as Eleonora. When I recall her again now, I somehow really can't help but wonder whether it really could have just been Jimpo cosplaying. Judging by how similar they look, they might be sisters, relatives, or, uh, that doesn't really make sense. She's a soul reaper while Senpai is a human. Even though she's the conclusion that leaves my mouth, uh, that, that's the con conclusion that leaves my mouth, the rational part of the back of my mind appeals to me. Is Senpai actually really human? Where's the proof of that, for that? What if An is in a similar situation to him, where somehow she almost died and that soul reaper was somehow forced into her to prolong her life or some bullshit like that or if that's the case so same as uh, uh, Jinpo can take on that Eleonora form he can take on his form <laughs> I don't know exactly what I should call her out on I don't know exactly how, uh, how exactly I should call her out on that, but the point is, I want to talk to her. If I remember correctly, yeah, I heard she drop, drops by the student council room every morning. Supposing that Soul Reaper and Semper really do have some kind of connection. Uh, what should I do once I figure that out? I find myself thoroughly unable to sort out my thoughts, but I still climb the hill road at a quick pace as I proceed towards school. As a while I arrive at the campus, that is, bears of students due to how early it is. At any rate, first and foremost, I went to the student council room. From now on, I'll just have to play it by ear. I make a beeline for the school building and enter it. Then I head for my shoe lockers in order to change into my slippers. But as I'm on my way there... Mom, that's why you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it. I hear a voice that sounds just like the very person I'm searching for. It's coming from the part of the entrance that's slightly off from where I came in. Senpai, having most likely saved myself the effort of searching for her, I approached the direction I heard the voice come voice from. Oh, Yuma-kun? Here's the problem. That is a bit too blatant to leave, so I'm probably gonna have to censor that. Like, that is too blatant. Just gonna have to like uh one, two, three, thirty-seven. <laughs> I found sent by on a stepladder in the middle of wiping the upper windows with a dust cloth. That really it was you. Good morning. Could I ask you the same? What are you doing here this early? Yeah, that's obvious. Uh, what I want to know is the why. <laughs> that made you come here early in the morning in order to clean them? Did you just say always? So that basically means that this isn't the manifestation of a random one-time whim. We're even doing something like this? That is evidently not within the scope of duties of a student council president. 
みんな朝から気持ちよく投稿できるでしょ I'm really just actually angry about the CG. This is like. This is too fucking blatant. It makes me scared that this is no actual all ages version and I'm gonna have to censor anyways. He was still cleaning the windows on her own accord without him having been asked by anyone to. It's something quite laudable in my book. So, did you make a whole lot? I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. With a cheerful smile on her face, she asked me somewhat impishly. In fact, she just said what, what she just said isn't that far off, at any rate. I already thought so, but it's, it's really not her. As I see her smile happily, I earn the conviction that despite the indeed existing similarities she has to that soul reaper, she clearly isn't her. The resemblance may be uncanny, but how should I put it? The vibe she gives off is completely different. Yuma-kun? What happened? I'm sorry to say that. There's nothing. More importantly, I'll help you clean the windows. That's okay. I'm already done with that. Is that right? でもまだ来たばっかりだよね。Anyway, let me give you a hand. Let's do this together. ユウマくんが一緒に。Was that reaction? ユウマくんが出れた。これは快挙ね。And she goes again, blabbing strange stuff that makes zero sense. もしかして何か悪いものでも食べたとか。I can't recall having usually conducted myself so defiantly that it warrants such concern. At any rate, let's switch places. Damn it! I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go to the other side. It's not like I can't understand the sentiment that when you're cleaning, cleaning places where the fruits of your labor are more visible feels more rewarding. However, ah,、uh, listen, Senpai. It's not like I can't understand the sentiment that when you're cleaning, No, there's something more fundamental than that.、Um, I've been meaning to tell you since a while now. I can see your panties. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't able to grasp the right timing. I can see that she looks quite flustered, which is pretty unusual for her. However, as she is probably unable to make sudden moves on top of the st- shaky stepladder, that ultimately only leads to perplexity. <laughs> Despite her evident bashfulness, she asks that with a wry smile, proud of that varnish over her embarrassment. I'd say I got a morning feast for the eyes. So, I courteously, courteously declined that offer. I don't really expect anything else, but this girl's apparent can't, leave, can't persist in displaying meek shyness. After that, I、uh, politely looked away while I、uh, extracted a dust cloth from the bucket put on the floor as I waited for a senpai to climb down. Thank you, by fucking god. Then both of us assiduously wiped windows for a while. <sighs> right, it's looking way better than before. Do you plan on finishing up tomorrow? Um, what do you want? Let's see, give me a call when you do, I'll give you a hand again. It's unusual for you to act so reserved, you know. Yes. At any rate, you can work me in times, you can work me in times like that, no problem. ありがとう。それじゃあ気が向いたらお手伝い頼むね。Yeah. でもどうしたの？今日はやけに親切じゃない。I'm always like this. <笑>そういえばそうだったかも。ユウマくんってば、私に対しては時々ちょっと冷たいから。That's because you constantly pull off stunts that ends that that stuff that ends up leaving you plain speechless in a negative way. That is. However, I guess she does have a point. Today I have a bit of a queasy conscience that compels me to make it up to her. It stems from my regret of having suspected her as a soul raper. But, really, thank you. You saved me. 
お礼のパンツは脱ぎたてがいい I think I already told you that I don't want it. もむ、なるほど。パンツは履かれていてこそ価値があると What kind of messed up interpretation is that supposed to be? みたいなら見せてもいいよ。先輩、you're actually a pervert and I just didn't realize it before. もう、冗談だけど、少しくらい興味を持ってよ。真顔で拒否られると、ちょっとムカつく。Your jokes are sort of hard to react to. It's an absolute mystery to me that she means. What she means to accomplish with jokes like that. Hmm. But, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it. What do you want You don't have to, but if you really insist, treat me to a can of coffee or something. Hmm. I'm going to go to the can of c o f f e actually closer to harassment than anything else. One can is enough. Yes, I know, Yuma. Talking to her seriously worries me out. And、uh, there must be something wrong with me for also enjoying it at the same time. Um, kind of think of it, Senpai. Nani? For some reason, I felt strangely embarrassed, so in a fluster, I choose to change the to topic in order to keep the conversation going. Who were you talking to before I approached you? Huh? Nano Hanashi? She tilts her head to the side as she asks back in puzzlement. Figured she was talking to someone on her cell phone or something. Did I get it wrong? No, I just forget about it. <laughs> so? それじゃあ早速お礼のコーヒーでも。As we packed up the cleaning utensils and we're about to leave. 俺、浅場君に、ジンポ先輩も。Turning out the fucking heating pillow thing. Ugh, my back is sweaty. <sighs> Someone who had just entered the building abruptly stops and attracts and addresses us. あ、ユーリだ。おはよう。おはようございます。二人ともこんな場所で何をしているんですか Morning, Tsukushima.、Um, we... 朝早くから仲がいいみたいですね。Why is she clearing at me? ちょっと、掃除してただけだよ。ほら。Exactly. I lift up the bucket in my hand in order to show Tsukushima. 本当みたいね。でもどうして二人で I just happened to come early today because I had some stuff to do. That I caught sight of Senpai who was in the middle of cleaning. So, no, no. I don't really understand why, but she directs a doubting gaze at me. So, you, Yuri, no, how do you know? Mother, home room, mother, what you can't look at. What does she want? Who keen the horny more? You, you got detected on the day. As I know, I sat on the side, I see you got one. So, 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 ですね、一人で校門に立つのはやっぱり少し寂しいですし浅場君は迷惑じゃない ?Of course, I'm mine.Alright, let's drop off our bags at a classroom first.40 秒で済ませるようにその後すぐ校門に集合ねどうしてジンポー先輩が仕切るんですかもう At any rate,、uh, we'll give you a hand, huh?She can actually count on me in together with herself. In the end, only time went by without me learning anything about the Soul Reaper named Eleonora. At school, I tried to find that pansy Soul Reaper called、uh, Hiberian, who I met before to see whether there was anything he could tell me, but, uh. Well, it should have been obvious that he wasn't, wouldn't just conveniently show up when I wanted him to. Heave a sigh, look at the clock in my room. Ultimately, the declared timeline had drawn near without me being able to do anything at all. Ah, no, no, Yuma san! What's the matter? While I'm seemingly losing my composure, Tina talks to me, somewhat tilting her head with a spell of puzzlement. Let me. I don't think I ever said I wanted you to. So, I think the one who actually feels lonely is you. If you don't want to sleep alone, you can go sleep in a way. No, I'll stay here tonight after all. いいんですか Yeah, at least for tonight. Later on, that Eleonora might appear. Actually, I guess it's a given that she will appear. Considering that, I should at least avoid involving Aoi and Konami in this. Though ideally, I don't want to、uh, let her come in contact with Tina as well. Yuma san, so let's go to the next one. I'll go to the next one. Tina pulls at my sleeve as if to hurry me. 
I should clear things up in secret after all. I don't want to pointlessly worry her if I can help it. For that, I'll step out for a bit. Yeah, there's something I need to buy at the convenience store. You've already changed your pajamas. It's nothing important or anything anyway. So just go to sleep. I'll join you in a bit. Put on my jacket and stuff my wallet in my pocket. And get ready to leave. Hey, Tina. Hi. We'll leave this room, okay? What do you doesn't matter, just do what I say. Get in my bed, lay around as you always do. Having said that to Tina, who reacted somewhat confusedly, I left my room. I swing by the, by the storeroom and take out a golf club that used to be my dad's. It might actually help if it was just some hoodlum, but chances are it won't help against a real soul reaper scythe. <laughs> like, it... If it actually turns out that they that that An and uh, Eleonora are sharing a body, he just like swings the golf club at at the shin, and suddenly it just quickly changes to An. Oh motherfucker! <laughs> just like what the fuck? Still better than nothing, I guess. Having positioned myself in front of the house on the same spot as yesterday, I wait for her to appear with this unreliable weapon in hand. It's almost midnight now. The deadline Eleonora p imposed on me. What the heck am I doing? I quietly muttered that to myself. Uh, about to that, but I uh, tell myself that I nevertheless can't just obediently do as she says and tighten my grip on the golf club. Then, probably having watched me from somewhere. <laughs> as if her form oozing out of the darkness, she appears at a spot where no one has been standing a mere seconds ago. It isn't midnight yet. <laughs> Wow, what a surprise. <laughs> oh, maybe I should actually turn my fucking webcam back on and I'm a fucking moron. Of course not. With that, she suddenly draws out her huge scythe from empty space. Uh, if you don't mind, I'll tell uh, I'd like to talk before that. It isn't about me, I want to talk about Tina. I'm talking about her feelings here. It might be true that she's a somewhat troublesome freeloader, but hearing another person talk ill of her naturally makes me to find with all seriousness. I know nothing about your soul reaper circumstances, but uh, Tina has a reason why she's running away from you, doesn't she? I beg you, give Tina a little more time. To begin with, why is it that you have to take her along? I suppose proverb verb to a deaf ear fits perfectly in such an instance. Damn it! Sure, my will did not yield by taking up a stance with the golf club tightly grasped in both my hands. <laughs> she smiles like a spell of, with a spell of delight. I see, so you're all eager to kill me. It would appear that there's no longer any room for negotiations. In that case, still, I'm not gonna. Uh, I will not back down! I strongly fortify both my readiness to fight and my determination to defy her. Eh? <laughs> what? Her eyes just glowed and, uh. Why? My body doesn't move an inch. It's as if the directives my brain issues are being rejected. Hey, what is this? My limbs are frozen solid. I can feel a chill that makes me shiver well up in, from the depths of my body. Paralysis? Uh, this fear? How? <laughs> 
You know what would be funnier though? If you like start talking smack like with uh, we soul reapers are the natural enemies of humans. If you defy, think of defying us, your instincts will reject the very notion. And so he just gets hit over the fucking head with the golf club. Ow! What the fuck? <laughs> like a frog that is glared at by a snake, I stand stuck still in response to the instinctive fear I experience. Even so, I won't get. I won't give in. Unable to move even the slightest, I at the very least keep my defiant attitude. So da. So de i. Koro sarete mo monku wa nai to. What have I done to her to bear that strong a grudge against me? As I gaze at Eleonora raising her scythe of red, that question suddenly crosses my mind. I try to close my eyes and await contact with the scythe she swings down on me. Unable to either dodge or stop the blow without any means to oppose, I. <laughs> However, no matter how much time passes, neither pain nor anything else assaults me. But what? What's going on? <laughs> As I slightly open my eyes, Eleonora is slowly drawing back the scythe that was meant to shred me apart. On is actually like that. This confirms that On shares her body, and she's actively like holding her back. Her hands trembling. Uh, it looks as if she's struggling with someone invisible for control of the weapon. <laughs> And then the large scythe shatters into stardust and appears disappears somewhere. Wait, is she talking to someone? Uh, uh, As I dumbfoundedly gaze at the soul reaper in front of me, I also suddenly noticed that control over my body had returned at some point. Did she just say on? And the other's body emits a pale yet strong light. Uh, thanks for actually having clothes on. <sighs> huh, Senpai? As the light faded instead of Eleonora, Jinpo was now in front of me. Yuma-kun, you Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Um, what's the meaning of this? えっと、これはその、ね。とりあえずごめんね。エレが失礼なことしちゃって。Okay. Perplexed as I am, I can only muster that crappy reply. あのね、誤解しないでほしいんだけど、あの子もね、本気で殺そうとしてたわけじゃないのよ。Tabu. And now she is serious, 100%. I have no idea what's going on anymore. However, judging by the fact that Eleonora transformed into Jinpo, I guess it's becoming clear that the Senpai and that Soul Reaper are one and the same. At least that's what seems plausible for now. Um, Senpai, what are you? Eh,っと... <laughs> if you're gonna explain it to me tomorrow, then yeah. Okay, got it. Tonikaku, she so with a somewhat troubled smile, then. She calls out in the direction where there is nothing but empty space. <laughs> Tina, you've been here? Gomene, Mo Muriari Trete Itari Shinaikara. Her large scythe and, b scythe and both trembling hands, it looks like she's just barely managing to hold her ground. <sighs> Senpai shrugs her shoulders in response to Tina's vigilant attitude. So you look at it, Yuma. Atashi Nairuto, Tina Chang, I'll be a car. Kill a kairune. 
Like, I just really wanted him to do, like, hold on before you leave. Can you switch over to Eleonora for, like, a second? Oh, why? I want to smack her. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we'll see each other tomorrow. Each other tomorrow. いつも通りに生徒会室で。Got it. ティナちゃんのこと、よろしくね。ボディングだ。センパイヘッドホームワイルウェイヒングアンドライトリー。ピーナチャピーライトナウ。オルトゥビバッドイフサモンソーヤサイトソプトイトウェイ。あ、はい
Bearing against a fear that wells up from deep within my heart, I persistently talk in a casual manner. <laughs> As she says, she uses a finger to tickle my chest and face. That. I desperately hold back by both the moan like voices that close, uh, that there, that's close, a uh, voice that's close to leaking out, and the tears that dare to follow, that dare to flow. Uh, uh, are you all so sorry, Perk? So I managed to squeeze out some words with a somewhat shaky voice. Please answer me, are you a soul reaper? Oh my god, she's a half blood. <laughs> Just half. I just really want him to at some point just like break out of the paralysis to just uh, whoever the poor bastard who's using it on him surprise. I, I know Iberia just like besides to paralyze him, but she's like, oh, now I can do with you whatever I want before a fucking fist just buries itself into his face. <laughs> her eyes that have been glowing red return to their normal color. <laughs> <laughs> the moment I regain control over my body, the sun's in shape, the sensation of a massive weight being lifted from my chest courses through me. Did my breathing stopped until just now? <laughs> I mind that, more importantly, dumb. Because I finally managed to calm down, what starts weighing on my mind the most is the sensation of her soft boobs that's pressing against me. Could you get off of me? As I attempt to clear this little problem of mine, I, I, so I attempt to clear this little problem of mine, but uh. For some reason, she's now the one who's displaying an expression of something akin to fear. Um, is something matter? Yeah,パリ。ね、秘密を知られるのはちょっと怖いかなって。え、気持ち悪いって思われたかも。これから一生避けられるようになっちゃうのかもって考えると怖くなっちゃうの。先輩。だからごめんね。もうちょっとだけご褒美あげるから嫌いにならないで。ああ、先輩。だけじゃなくて理由に失敗しているブーズ I'm already living on the same roof with Tina, a soul reaper, so I don't have the least bit of an intention to avoid her simply because she turned out to be a soul reaper. Yuma-kun. Did that thing sink in? Arigato. Nevertheless, still just as ang just still just a bit anxious, she could continue to motionlessly cling to me for a while. Gomenne, most likely, having settled down somehow, she finally moves her body away from me and slowly stands up. It's fine, I don't mind. さて、心の準備もできたし。それじゃ、ちゃんと私の正体を話しておくね。オッケー。私はね、死神と人間のハーフなんだ。ハーフ、ソーリ。Can can yeah, true. I see. The chose not to pry too deeply into it. Judging from my own experience of having lost my parents, I know that this is that I know that that is what the person's concerned appreciate the most. お前ももう大人なんだからって長年放置されてるんだ。いや、アダルトね。おっと、レディに年を聞くのは NG だからね。I other personality。性格にはちょっと違う気もするけど、人間としての私と死神としてのエレ。二人が一つの体を共有しているの。It's sort of complicated making my understanding of it rather vague. 起きている間は私が人間としてこの体を使って 
寝ている間はエレンが死神としてこの体を使えるって感じかな。So, in short, Eleonora, who also lives inside your body, was in control last night. Is that about right? So, so, daitai son na image. Atashi ga nete iru aida ni Eren ga shinigami no shigoto o shite kureru no. In that case, can't I consider her, as she is now, more or less human? That thought suddenly crosses my mind. So, 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 Hearing her faintly mutter, her faint mutter, which partly seemed to have been monologue, I conclude that I probably shouldn't pry in regards to that either. Ano ne, Yuma kun. Kino anna koto ga atta ba kari de, shinji te mo rae nai ka mo shire nai kedo. Ere mo, warui ko ja nai nda yo. She was trying to kill me though. You, you stand by that claim then, nevertheless? Tashka ni so da kedo. Kino mo itta tori, tabun honki ja na katta. Ultimately, that's just probably, huh? Tonikaku, Ikiteru Hito, Jibun de Korostariwa, Eremo Stakoto Naino. Sokoa Honto da Karasinite. Even though she's a soul raper, Kokai Sinai de Hosina Kedo, Sinigaminga Hito Korosuke Janainda. Watasta Chua Shisha no Karadakara, Tamashi o Karitoru dake. As she says, so I guess it must be true. However, I can't bring myself to consider Eleonora a good person. She blatantly threatened me. There was no way to sugarcoat that. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. For Tina's sake? Yes. I was with Tina. I was with you and Ere. I was with you. 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 That, together with you? I was with you. I was with you. I was with you. あの子はまだ生まれてからそれほど長くなくて、仕事はしていなかったから。Um, so up, Brina, Tina ran away from your place? そう。一応エレが保護者というか、師匠みたいな立場になるのかな。死神の仕事を教えていたの。Unexpectedly so, the runaway girl's personal back background came to light. Um,、uh, should I make her go back to your place then? うーん、どうなんだろうな。エレは連れ戻したがっているみたいだけど。That wording lets me infer that she seems to have a different opinion on that. ねえ、ユーマくん。こんなこと頼むのは無責任だと思うけど、もうしばらくはティナちゃんを預かってくれないかな。Sure, that's what I originally had in mind anyway, but uh... 知ってるかもしれないけど、ティナちゃんは死神になるのが嫌で家出しちゃったの。Yeah. でも、エレはティナちゃんを、なるべく早く一人前の死神に育てたいと思っててね。I recall the reason Tina gave us for why she ran away that time she first came to us. I was told to work, she said. I see that. So that's what, this is about, what it is about. If you just take it by word, she simply comes off as a spoiled child, but since this, in this instant, work means to fulfill her duty as a soul reaper,、uh, so basically she had a fight with Eleonora and ran off. Since I'm not able to assert that either of them is in the wrong, I could only express it in such a plain way. まあ、簡単に言っちゃえばそういうことになるのかな。しかも、今のところ仲直りできそうな要素がないって感じ。Let's see. だからね、連れ戻してもまた家出されて、今度こそ本当に行方不明になられても困るの。And that's why she wants me to let her stay at our place for a bit longer, it would seem. I already said it just now, but I've intended to shelter Tina from the start. I don't mind that at all. いいのありがとう。それと、ごめんね。You want to apologize. Fortunately, both Asaba and Konami enjoy having Tina around. Don't, don't mind it. そっか。よかった。最近はずっとエレンが心配して早く探せって大変だったんだよ。Really? That's true, e l e o n o r a must be unexpectedly. あごめん、ちょっと待って。え分かってるから、今はちょっと黙ってて。はいはい。相変わらず素直じゃないな。Who is she talking to? <笑>ごめんね、お待たせ。What was that monologue about? 頭の中でね。
エレンが余計なこと言うなって怒鳴ってたの Is that what it means to have two personalities in one body? 二人とも起きてる時は私に体の支配権があるんだけどね See, that's why last night senpai,、uh... 逆に私が寝ているとエレンが勝手に出てこれるから<笑>昨日は本当にごめんね、oh, spilled milk, so、However, あんまり心配しししなないいで大丈夫だだよ過激なとこもあるけどエレってただのツンデレだし I mean, said that she sticks her tongue out, but then. Ah! Go me, go me, and Deba! Moo, you are like a woke in a quite as a night! What seems she got told off by Eleonora inside her mind. Um, back to Tina. Ah. Uh. Hina, he told it, go me, must I? Seems she's aware of the fact that she comes off as a widow when she speaks to herself. So did Tina Changa, Dostano? He's acting as a self proclaimed love fairy at the moment. Is it okay to just leave her be at In that regard, love fairy. But、uh, isn't it understandable that she simply doesn't want to do Soul Reaper work? In response to my remark, she falls silent with a troubled expression. Is that so? Is that so? 死者の魂を刈り取って新しい命へと運ぶんだフェリーダムリンネ転生の仲介役ってところかな She says so As she says so She looks like a She looks just a bit proud in my eyes 魂を刈るときは死神だけど他のときに天使って呼ばれることもあるんだから That's why the fucking wings Angels It's like the complete opposite だからねあんまり怖がらないでほしいかな。あたしもエレンも傷ついちゃうから。あんたがプーズンをパラライズにぶっ込みダウンはずらいとせいだ。それはえっと、あほら、死神でも天使でも、なめられるわけにはいかないし。あたしはもっと、あたしは、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、References that, even slightly, like just like they see someone who introduces themselves as an angel, and somebody's just like, Yeah, yeah, right, where, where are you? Are the, where are you? Are the rise? Come on, I know what you are. Be not afraid, and all that. Hey, boy, however, angels, huh? They're called Tina's small white wings, and. Now that I think about it, I was given life by a harbinger of death. I've experienced with my own body that there is a meaning to the alias angel. Ma, to the eyes of a conna to Korokana. Hokani Nanika Stimo Aru? Let's see. Still have. I still have plenty of questions left to ask, but I haven't managed to sort them out in my head just yet. Mata eats them, Ki de Kurepa Ikara. Okay, that helps. Ah, so let on eh? あとでユウマくんのうちにお邪魔してもいいかな。My place, sure, I don't mind. ティナちゃんのこと。一応ちゃんとご挨拶しておかないとね。Later that same day. というわけで、実はティナちゃんは、私の親戚なんです。そ、そうだったの意外なところに保護者さんがいたんだね。Oh, yeah, I was also surprised. Senpai who came along with me to my place explained to Konami and Aoi that Tina is her relative. Not just lying with a straight face, though. でも、虐待されて家出してきたって聞いてるけど。あ<笑>、それはさすがに言い過ぎですね。うーん。Tina knows that Ileonora is inside a senpai, that's probably why she looks extremely uncomfortable right now. So, but, I'm not sure. 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 Maybe someone like Aoi is actually the true angel here. Where are her eyes? Where are her eyes? Come on, show me! 
うんうんティナちゃんってばいい人に拾われたなそうだねユウマくんってばとってもいい子だものね I'm pretty sure she was talking about she wasn't talking about me though. Oh well. あのそれでティナさんはこれからどうすればあーうんそれなんだけど Seems Senpai changed into a serious mode as she brings forth an expression lined with graveness and sadness. 虐待は言い過ぎですけどちょっとこの子の家庭は複雑でいろいろ訳ありなためティナちゃんは心に傷を負ってしまったんです。She lied as naturally as you breathe. そ、そうなのはい。それで、今すぐ元の家に連れ戻すのもどうかな、と思ってまして。厚かましいお願いで申し訳ないですが、もうしばらく、ティナちゃんをこの家で預かってはいただけませんかそれはもちろん、構わないけど。Mostly, most likely due to the fact that this would mean she'd also assume the responsibility to help Tina's heart recover upon herself. A fleeting spell of hesitation shows on Aoi's face. Well, this, that is also nothing but a lie, so. <laughs> so that we have a solid explanation for everything, there is, in fact, no reason to worry about that. I'm going to do a lot of work with Tina. I'm going to do a lot of work with Tina. I'm going to do a lot of work with Tina. I'm going to do a lot of work with Tina. 私なんかにそんな大事なことはお願いしますティナちゃんを癒してあげるには浅羽先生じゃないとダメなんです私じゃないと私もうどうしていいかわからなくて<笑>浅羽先生のこと頼ったらいけませんかた頼られてる新報さんみたいな優秀な子が私みたいな新米教師を頼ってくれている兄さんこれ Don't say anything At the same time I begin to feel the early signs of a surging headache in response to this cheap farce 新報さん分かったわ先生に先生に任せて<笑>ありがとうございます、浅場先生アオイ has capitulated. She fell for it, huh? 落ちたね。ユウマくんとコナタンもティナちゃんのことよろしくね。It's the end result that I've wished for myself, but there are steps to the process that didn't go、well, down so well with me. 普通の生活か。それじゃあまずは今夜も美味しいご飯を作らなくっちゃね。神保さんも夕飯一緒に食べていって。ああ、い,いえ、私は遠慮なんてしなくていいから。ね、ね。<笑>それじゃあ、ごちそうになっていきます。よし、それじゃあますます頑張らないと。みんな、少しだけ待っててね。葵さん。私も手伝うね。アオエイ・コナミ・ワークオフ・トゥ・ド・キッチン・イン・オーダー・プレイ・ディナー。ふぅ、これで一件落着っと。It was unexpectedly harsh to see my own mother dance in the palm of someone else's hand. うご、ごめんね。でも、全部正直に話すわけにはいかないでしょ ?Oh, you're right about that. あの、ユーマさん。Tina, who has been quietly listening to our conversation, pulls up my sleeve. Something the matter? Yeah, you can. We'll all, be to stay, we'll all stay together if that's what you want. As I say so, I pat Tina's head. Which one? ティナちゃんってそんな風にも笑うんだなって。Driving from the fact that she used to live with Tina, that must mean that she didn't really smile before. Maybe living this house has positive effects on Tina? しかし今のティナちゃんの笑顔な、なんでしょう。すんごい可愛いああ、もうやっぱりお持ち帰りしたくなってきたあ、アンさんの病気が…ディズイーズねえね
、ティナちゃん。お姉さんと遊ぼう。綺麗なお洋服買ってあげるから、撮影させて、ね。あの。いらないです。わあ、髪からいい匂い。コナタンと一緒のシャンプーを使ってるのかな。あ、先輩。私にも頭なでなでさせて。それから、さっきの笑顔をもう一回。嫌ですあは困ってる顔もかわいいこのまま冷凍して永久保存しておきたいうユーマンさん助けてくださいディーナス・デスペリー・シーキング・フォー・ヘルプ・ワー・センパイ・デスペリー・ハグ・ザ・ノア・アン・トップ・ダッド・ロップ・ザ・チークス・アゲンスターズまた始まってしまいましたねコトロ、who naturally remains silent in the presence of our economy, whispers. It triggered again, huh? I suppose it, I can assume that she's a habitual offender then.、Um, senpai, freezing her naturally strikes me as、uh, bizarre. I'm going to take a look at the toast in the figure. I'm going to take a look at the toast in the figure. Oh, that stuff that leaves her mouth is actually sort of gross. <laughs> 本当に助けてください。先輩、ティーナス、ティーナス、seriously doesn't like it。As I manage to wedge myself between them and peel 先輩 off of Tina。おいう、ユーマくんの意地悪。<笑>ありがとうございます、ユーマさん。<笑>ユーマくんばっかりずるい。ティナちゃん、私ともイチャイチャしてよ。<笑>私。お部屋に戻っていいですか yeah, I think that's for the best. そ、それでは失礼しますあ、ちょっと、ティナちゃんジンポ sorrowfully stares after Tina, whose fright, fright animates her to flee this place instantaneously. うん、頭なでなでしたかったのに。The scene makes me suddenly recall how she ended up tearing off her plushie's ear. 逃げられちゃったし。代わりにユウマくんをなでなでしてもいい ?No thanks. えー、どうして ?Maybe your fight with Eleonora wasn't the only reason Tina ran away. I know it's that thought crossing my mind. After we ate dinner and I saw Senpai off. いやー、とりあえずはこれで丸く収まりましたかね。Yeah. As it turns out, in conclusion, Tina has been officially taken in as a freeloader. But, anyways, Kotaro. Hi. I must say that you've been of no use whatsoever during this whole ordeal. So, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I think you even explicitly stated that Eleonora is scary upon which you made yourself scarce. Yeah, no. 別に怖かったわけでは。で、わあティナ様どうして投げ捨てようとなさるのですかおい。コトロ、who has been the part,、uh, who has the part of Tina's head, draws a beautiful arc and lands right in the trash bin. やりました。Nice one, Tina! However, according to what you said, it really seems like that also was some other reason. いいんです全然助けてくれなかったですから。As you can say that, but、uh, it's all been sorted out for the time being, so why don't you just let him off this time? ユーマさんがそう言うなら。But anyhow, to think that even Jinbo has been a soul raper, albeit half human to be precise all along. Tina and now also Senpai, sort of strange, sort of a strange feeling to know that the people I normally talk with every day are actually <laughs> soul rapers. So they're soul rapers. One of my things turned out this way. I suddenly recall my life's first encounter with a soul raper. I'm sure that there are. that the day when. I'm sure that was the day when everything began. begun. began or begun. I'm sure that was the day when everything began, I feel. I don't know how that event is connected to the present, so I don't really have a proper understanding of it, nor grounds for that belief, though. Still, I can't help but feel that way. <laughs> hey, Tina, come to think of it. Hi, what is it? No, forget it.、Mm-hmm. It's not really worth mentioning after all, so don't mind it. 
Till now, I've tried to inquire Tina about that Soul Reaper girl several times. However, I don't know why, or whether it's something she simply can't talk about, but she evidently changes the topic and gives me the slip whenever I do. I've probably given up on it since I don't have any reason to get it out of her. If she doesn't want to talk about it, but Senpai might know, might know something about her. Judging by Tina, Soul Reapers don't seem to like to talk about other Soul Reapers, so I don't know whether she'd agree to tell me if I did, if she did know something. But I suppose it doesn't hurt to ask. Alright, uh, once that's decided, it's time to tack on the action to the word. Then I'll go to sleep already. Whoops. After you've taken your bath, change to sleepwear, well, yeah. I'll get up early again and go ask Senpai about this. Can't exactly talk with Senpai about Soul Reaper stuff unless we're alone. For that reason, I didn't wait for Konami and Mio and just went on ahead to the school early in the morning. Guess I'll go to the student council room first. If I don't find her there, I'll call her cell phone. As I ruminate about these things, I pass through the school gates. I'm just... I'm just a bit paranoid. However, the moment I enter the school building... Ha. Ah, spot her once again, wiping the windows of the entrance. I assume she's continuing where she left off the other day. Uh, we left off the other day. I fucking knew this was gonna happen. Good morning, Senpai! Oh, Yuma-kun! Just like last time, once I address her, she turns to me from atop the stepladder and looks down on me. Well, yeah, but more importantly, I can see her panties again. You also possess ones that aren't? I guess she has a cuter taste than I th thought. Unfortunately, she's wearing quite normal panties today. Actually, rather than minding color, design, and stuff like that, make sure that you I don't see it in the first place. Whoops. That's not the issue here. あ、思い出した。今日のは見られても恥ずかしくないやつだ。これなら好きなだけ見ててもいいよ。あ、ウォン。またまた。パンツは見られてこそ価値があるって心の中で力説してるでしょ。あ、you what do you expect from me then? I resent such words. By the way, Senpai, I proceed to de or assiduously ignore her and change the topic while subtly averting my eyes. Yeah, leaving that aside, didn't you tell me to call you when you go about finish? Uh, didn't I tell you to call me when you go about finishing the cleaning here? Judge by your reaction, it's fairly obvious that you remember. <laughs> well, I can't say I can't relate to that. Regardless, I'll wipe the upper windows. Having said that, I take out a dust cloth from the bucket at my feet. Get that kind of disturbing payback method out of your head already. <laughs> Treat me to a can of coffee like last time. That's actually perf. That, that's perfectly enough. You don't have to. It's just that I can't have the student council president do all the work by herself. What is it then? It's nothing. With neither act nor falsehood mixed in, an extremely soft, honest smile. Saying that smile before me, I get somewhat embarrassed. Anyway, your posture there is poisonous for my eyes. Get down from there. Hi! It's also poisonous for the, my fucking ad revenue. After that, I climb the stepladder in her place and help her wipe the windows for a while. That, of course, is a joke. It is, however, still po poisonous for the existence of my video. So, <sighs> shoo. <laughs> the front windows look clean now. 
together with the windows. We had to light the other day. We've somehow managed to finish all of them with time still left to spare before homeroom. I don't think that many student will know, students will notice, though. Well, it's not that I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. However, if nobody else. I think at least I could praise her for having cleaned the windows this diligently. Uh, hold up. My back has been split in two! I'm back. Oh, fuck. That sounded like a, th like a thousand ribs, uh, ribs breaking. Fuck, Jesus Christ, it felt fucking amazing now. My chest has been alleviated from pain. I ref uh, yes, I already read that. He voluntarily serves as student council president too. You really, really, you must really love your, love our school. It's honestly commendable in my book, which I wanted to add, but I. うーん確かに私も好きではあるんだけど性格にはちょっと違うかなあそう あえっとなんていうか she, she throws a glimpse at me while I tilt my head in puzzlement and appears to ponder about something for a while うんユウマくんになら話してもいいか uh, what do you mean? 立ち話もあれだからちょっと場所を変えない? Sure, I don't mind. I lift the, the bucket that holds the cleaning utensils and proceed to, uh, further <gasps> into the building together with her. Thanks. Shortly after we've entered the room, she passes me the promised can of coffee which she had brought on, bought on route. Um, so, picking up where we left off. Uh, um. She opens her own can of coffee while tilting her head self questioningly. So, she's suggesting to drink our coffees as we talk. I suppose well, she wants to maintain a relaxed atmosphere. Well, yeah. I somewhat I'm somewhat reluctant to admit that. Review you your usual conduct and ask yourself that question. However, since you really do a splendid job as our president, I improved my opinion of you. I pull the tap of the coffee and take a sip. It appears she isn't fully pleased with my answer. Regardless, I'll try to have her continue. Um, so you just said, strictly speaking, that's not exactly right. Did you mean you to say you aren't a hard worker? Uh, 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 what does she mean? She has a specific reason for doing it? Yeah. Coffee tastes a bit bitter. Memories. And what was that? The memories. True. その記憶はどこに行ってしまうのかっていうと答えは簡単。私たち死神が背負っているの。You shoulder their memories。死んだ人の記憶を受け継ぐって言った方がいいかな。それでエレンが運んだ魂の記憶は私も共有しているの。Wouldn't that slowly but surely destroy your psyche, though? What that exactly means doesn't quite sink in as she explains that to me in a rather casual manner. 例えば、ほら。私って将棋が強いでしょ Nah, of course not. Thinking that economy is basically being trained by a pro isn't too bad in and of itself. 
She breathed a sigh of relief. I remember how she mentioned just yesterday that it was scary for her to tell someone about her secret. But, uh, I can take it that, uh, that's something rather convenient. Sorry. But she succeeds all the memories of her life. Not only the good and the happy things, but all the, the scornful things as well. Everything. Whoops. Oh my god, is she, is she the one who reaped his father's soul? Upon that, she begins to talk with someone with lonesome expression on her face. Just... I just keep quietly listening to her story. ずっと。あ、ちょっと聞き、with affectionate gentle lives, Senpai talks about that girl who ended up dying. Is that the reason why you're serving as student council president? さっきまでガラスを拭いていたのだってあの子が綺麗にしておきたいって思ってた場所だからね。結局私は他人の気持ちに便乗しているだけなの。Kind of, with what kind of feelings does she do all these things? Bottom line is that she's fulfilling the wish of that dead girl, I suppose, but... So in short, you've succeeded that former president's will, is that correct? <laughs> she looks at me with an awkward smile. <laughs> でも、課題評価をされても気持ちは複雑になるから。あ、そっか。本当にみんな。私のこと立派とか誤解しちゃって困っちゃう。no thanks, this kind of coffee here is more than enough as a reward. But I deal with the senpai who has re returned to her usual antics, I absentmindedly think... As I deal with senpai who has returned to her usual antics, I absentmindedly think... Usual playful merry self isn't all there it is to her after all. I'd ask her about the soul reaper though! Ask her about the soul reaper though! After I left the student council room, I made my way to my classroom and arrived just before homeroom starts. Oh, Asabaku. Eh, more than catching sight of me, Mio and Tsukushima approach. Well, kinda. Sorry, Mio, I had to talk to Senpai. Jinpo Senpai ni? After I replied to her, I suddenly re recall my original intentions for coming in early, albeit far too late. I can think of it, I didn't ask her. Well, it's not like something I... It's like it's something I need to know immediately anyway. So it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Is it just me or do you two harbor some weird suspicion of me? <laughs> you were daydreaming. What was your daydream about? Why a sex change? Why involve a sex change? Just so you know, I only helped you out with cleaning like I did before, that's all. わかりました。信用してあげます。Thanks for understanding. But anyhow, I see. 
as we are, that the students who notice those things. In fact, makes me feel a bit relieved. ねえねえ。ところで明日から連休だよね。そうだけどどうかしたの？せっかくだからどこかにお出かけしたいなって。ゆりちゃんは何か予定ある？大丈夫よ。特に用事とかはないから。while I gazed at Mio and Tsushima, who have started making plans for the Golden Week, wondered how Jinpo would be spending her holidays. For the first half of Golden Week, having passed uneventfully, we've arrived at the 29th of April. There's nothing, don't mind it. In spite of the fact that today is a holiday, Konami and I have come to the student council room. So we need to prep the papers to be used for tomorrow's meeting, right? Uh Long story short, it was only last night when Konami remembered that she still has things to make ready for tomorrow. Visibly in a sweat, she told me she'd go to school today and I couldn't bring my I couldn't bring myself to simply leave her alone, thus I've come along to help. There aren't that many papers just for the committee meetings, so this shouldn't take long, right? Does ever could just stand smug and contented when my sister works? Now let's get started, I'll help you file the copies and handouts, so put together all the papers we need first. As she looks through the original copies, she suddenly freezes up. What's wrong? It seems there was a paper mixed in that hasn't been approved by the student council president yet. Alright, I'll give her a call then. With that, she takes out her cell phone and presses the call button. Feels she is picking up. That's a little problematic. She starts to ruminate on whether there's some kind of solution to this dilemma. But unusually for her, usual for her, she appears to be at a loss and seeks my help. Uh, it looks like there's no other choice, I'll swing by her place. You put together all the other papers and finish the copying while I'm away. Once I'm back, we'll do the filing together. Let's since I don't know what papers are needed, only Konami can handle that part. Consequently, this should be the most efficient approach. Sure thing, her address is noted in the register of me register of members, right? I'll go there immediately then. If anything else comes up, call my cell phone. I take the register she holds out to me and checks sent by the address. It's not that far off. If she is not at the moment, this should be quick. I want to keep you waiting too long. Alright, I'm off then. Thus, seen off by Konami, I left the student council room. With a little over 10 minutes of roaming around the vicinity of the address listed in the register gone by, I've reached my destination. And the place that matches the noted address has turned out to be uh, somewhat surprising. Here? An orphanage? The building right in front of me is most likely an orphanage, I think. <laughs> like how I actually managed to recognize that as an orphanage. Exactly, though, it seems to. It seems there's also a retirement home here as well. <laughs> how convenient! It has both the end and the beginning! Haha! <laughs> At any rate, several little children are running around in, front of the, in the front yard past the entrance gate. This can't be the wrong place, right? Judging by the address plate, uh, uh, it's put near the, the gate. This really must be Jinpo's residence, but unable to acquire conviction that I'm indeed at the right address, I find myself slightly puzzled about what I should do. However, before I could make my mind of, make up my mind for good... What? yuma feeling of relief for surfaces as I hear that fam this familiar voice from the side. <laughs> she 
She runs up to me with nine steps, which is about a big supermarket plastic bag she's carrying. I suppose she just came back from shopping. Hey, Senpai! Nani, nani? Yes, of course, I'm... <laughs> Correct? No, I really did come to see you. Wrong, I came here because I have business concerning the student council with you. Sorry that I'm even intruding on your place because of this. Uh, you didn't pick up when we tried to call you, so we really had no other choice. I'd be thankful if you had it with you as much as possible. <laughs> the kids? In response to her words, I shift my gaze to the building before me, which I've guessed to be uh, an orphanage. Um, Senpai, do you live here? Yes, Figures that the address listed in the register was actually correct after all. That thought never even occurred to me. Also, I'd be grateful if you spared me from weird outbursts like that. Don't say stuff like that in a place like this. It lacks consideration in regards to proper, uh, properly educating young children. I'm pretty sure there's, an ab there's absolutely nothing wrong about what I said, though. Uh, so regarding the fact that you're living here. Ah, I see, so there's also a retirement home on the premises. That's by you. <laughs> I was just joking. Seeing that she gave me a seriously grim look for a moment, I suppose she must be minding it, uh, rage and stuff. You mean you're part of the staff? I see. Student council president at school and live in volunteer at home. Just how much of a virtuous mind does she own? As I once again admire the extent of her goodwill. Girl who pulls at on skirt. Has, a, a girl who pulls at on skirt has showed up. Masked with an anxious countenance, she timidly looks up at Senpai. Chanto boiter yo. Following that, the girl gazes at me apologetically. Um, hello? I suppose I can take it that she's unsure of whether she can go and play with Senpai since she has me over as her guest. Yeah, no problem. I recall that Konami said there's no need for you to hurry. Thus, yielding to the gaze of the little girl, my decision was set that very instant. Okay, I suppose I stuff. I'll stay for a while then. On that holiday in the early afternoon, I was invited into the an orphanage for the first time in my life. By the way, uh, kids are little innocent creatures that don't know the word reservation just yet. Mina, today. あ、姉ちゃんが男連れてきた。やっ。本当だ。すげえ。しかもイケメン。姉ちゃん彼氏。彼氏だ。熱愛発覚だ。ワイズファイアリーロフトテクテッド。ドキミダッド、ワッシュ
upon that, Senpai throws a quick glance at me. I just really want him to just like suddenly roll up the, uh, the, the document he needs her to sign, just smack her over the head with it. Wrong, I'm just her junior. I'm Asuma, Asuma Yuma, best regards. Mm. <laughs> That's because you lie with unflinching con confidence. Together with an exasperated gesture and blatantly obvious full sobbing, she breaks down crying. With that scene, warm giggles fill the room. I see, I suppose she's quite the popular one here as well. A little girl who had come to the gate to greet Senpai on her return runs up to her with small steps. Well, I gaze at Senpai's back as she supposedly heads to the kitchenette with the kids. Can't help but think how nice the atmosphere here is. Having added me a mug of warm with warm tea, Senpai, surrounded by small children, children begins to read a picture book. I think I've seen this one in the opening. くまさんは蜂蜜が大好き。出来たてのホットケーキにたっぷりと蜂蜜をかけていきます。ホットケーキ食べたい。とろとろ、とろとろ、ドパーン。ふわふわのホットケーキは蜂蜜でびちゃび
あ、来てし。さあ、オーライ。世の中捨てたものじゃないんだよ。そういうことしてくれる人、時々いるんだよね。あ、せ。チームザタウンハズサムマスクッドサムアーティンズ。ワーバー、ワーバーザヤードだね
その人の記憶は私が背負っているんだ。She appears somewhat uncomfortable, but smiles nonetheless. So, in order to make that girl happy, you.、Uh, yes. Is that the reason why she's wearing a different uniform? So, I'm not sure, but I'm not sure. What do you mean? This is a good one. I'm not sure. 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 I mean, because of that, the clothes he designed weren't adopted in the end. She nods in response. But, I don't know if you're a good guy. I'm not sure if you're a good guy. I'm not sure if you're a good guy. I'm not sure if you're a good guy. I suppose that's a regret you left behind. That's why I'm not sure if you're a good guy. I want to fulfill his dream in this place. So, in that way, do you think he's going to be able to do it? Dressing his juniors from his alma mater in the uniform he made with his own hands. Jinpo lives out this dream of his, even if it's just a tiny fraction of it. I'm starting to feel embarrassed of myself for thinking it was just an act of selfishness. I'm going to be able to do it. 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 I'm going to Because he was worried about his daughter left behind. She makes a face that look, slightly looks like she's a mic to cry. Senpai? Were other people's memories to serve one's heart this gravely? Well, you're if you say that she does nothing but commiseration, you can't argue it away, but damn, I can't say anything to refute. But still, I couldn't bear to see her smile sorrowfully. That person, the girl's father, j e r y s smiling in heaven. ないと思うよだって魂は生まれ変わって記憶は私のところにあるんだもの喜んでくれるはずのその人はもういないの Still, can possibly accept her words deeply sad feelings When I eventually die, I'd be happy if it was someone like you who came and read my soul ユーマくんそっかありがとう There's no way she'd be satisfied with my assertion. I'm sure she can't find any consolation in these cheap words of mine. Konatan is waiting for me, right? I'm going to go soon. Yeah. She's smiling at me like usual, but her eyes are still filled with sorrow. That night, by the time I returned to my room after dinner. Oyama! You're a very good person. Does that wonder what Kotaro is talking about? about. Get out! Daddy! Oh, he's a s h i b u l l y Leave! I see, that is indeed an irritating guest! Nani was in the town, this to Tina Sama no Ken this Tara, Sudeni Ere Sama Mo. ここで暮らしているのはご承知でございますよガキンチのことなんてどうでもいいわ私は坊やに会いに来たのよ Me, is there something you need from me? 決まってるでしょ愛を語りに来たのよ Well,、uh, you certainly came for the right thing because you'll get nothing Wink! He sends a wink flying at me, devoid of the slightest speck of hesitation. Thanks a lot,、uh, I feel like throwing up now. Bad k i p back to bite me, Dios! That was not my point. Oh, 
そのくらいにしてくださいませんかねヒュペ様それとも私がお相手いたしましょうかうざったいクソ犬ねやりたいって言うならあんたの腹渡た引きずり出してやるわい Hey don't fight in my room this late at night ごめんなさい坊やが言うなら何もしないわ This gross in all seriousness 何気にユーマ様キュベ様に言うことを聞かせられる唯一のお方となりましたねそうなのよ私が言うこと聞くなんて坊やだってだからしばらく一緒にお話ししましょう Sorry, I failed to understand that reasoning. As I heave a deep sigh, something occurs to me, making me rally myself. Kind of think of it.、Uh, well, it's something clearly evident, so the phrasing is a bit weird, but、uh, you're also sorry, aren't you? So, yeah. You might just be the right person to get a different opinion from Senpai regarding Soul Reaper matters. There's something I'd like to ask you. Soul Reaper's shoulder and the memories of the Soul Stay Fairy, correct? Oh, no. Get within one meter of me and I will kick you on the balls. Actually, I won't because they probably like it. Spare me from that. <laughs> well, no particular reason, just pondered. Just wondering how that feels. Missy? Ah, you mean Senpai and Eleonora? So, yo. ま、一応、私と同じくらいの古株なんだけど。I don't know how Iberian is, but、uh, for him to refer to himself as a veteran, I guess his age must reflect that title. Which means Eleonora, no, Senpai is also. But how did you know that it was about her? 記憶のことなんて気にするの、お嬢くらいだもの。そこのガキンチョはろくに仕事もしてないし。So, in short, you mean to say that you aren't concerned over the memories you have? Ah, tari mai yo! Honto! Obaka san yo ne, ojo te! What do you mean? s o u n d like he's denying Sepai's gentleness, which made me somewhat irritated. Dante! Shinda ningen no koto nan te, ichi ichi kini ste tara, miga mota nai wa yo! Honto ni, ojo te ba! So、that means、uh, it's normal to get, not get concerned. It's normal not to get concerned. I don't know. 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 I d o そんなの一つ一つ相手にしてたら気が狂うってば。And he says that, I guess he has a point. Every soul contains a human life, human's lifetime worth of memories. If you keep countlessly, if you keep countless amounts of those inside you, there's no way you can remain sane. だから、私は欲望に忠実なの。男同士のただれた日々を過ごしましょう。Leave. I see. And I have a very good understanding of the existence of your talent for pissing me off. There is no love, so that won't work. Also, I think it's about time for you to return to wherever you came from. <laughs> it's not like I think your mindset is wrong or anything, though. <laughs> Thereat, the pansy soul reaper, for some reason, suddenly softens his expression. Nah, boy, yeah. Ojo, I had to go to the bag of the 
本当なのよ。Do you mean with these words, you quietly dissipate into the air? あの、ユーマーさん ?What is it? いえ、なんでも。I s a y What face am I making right now, I wonder? If you mind at the memories of every single dead human, you'd ruin yourself, huh? So that just how much of a heavy burden is sent by shouldering. Even though I can't even begin to imagine it, for some reason I felt a constricting pain in my heart. <sighs> The next day, with the first block of Golden Week all days over, school finished uneventfully. <sighs> school bags in hand, we student council members from the same class leave the classroom together. Today, we'll have a simple meeting at the student council room, and after that, we'll, leave the, we'll have the committee meeting, so. You've got something? She's restlessly rubbing her thighs together. Ah, I see. Alright. I suppose she has to use the restroom. Yuri-chan, Oshiko? I'm going to go to the restroom. 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 I'm going to go to the r e スレーションはミオちゃんたちと行ってくるわんえコエタくん女子トイレに入るのいやさすがに風紀委員長の前でそれはできねえかな当たり前ですそんなこと許しません There's really about going to the toilet if they make such a ruckus These guys are really quite lively Calm down the three of you just go already Tsukushima's gonna pee herself if you take too much time もらしませんミオ行きましょううんユウくんまた後でねおーばいあ、you won't go so? strikes me as odd that so is still tagging along with me despite Miu and Tsukushi Shima having already left so I raised that question いやだって男子トイレと女子トイレ隣同士だしミオちゃんたちも俺に入るとこ見られたくないっしょ。Kind of 紳士だからな。本物の紳士は、口ではなく、態度からにじみ出るものなんだぜ。Be more conscious of what you say as well, and、uh, while you're at it,、uh, don't talk about your fetishes in front of others. 今はそれ関係なくね It's, an inherent, it's inherently part of the category, be conscious of what you say. After all, this dude goes and nonchalantly lays it on the line, even if it, it's someone who he sees for the first time. Sure. He walks off in the direction of the men's restroom. Well, I suppose I'll just go ahead then. Proceeding with the leisurely steps by myself, I eventually arrive before the student council room. I noticed that the door of the to the student council room was just a wee bit open. It would appear that either Senpai or Economy have already arrived before me. So I hesitantly open the door like I always do! Oh, I'm so tired! Oh, I'm so tired! I'm so tired! Her eyes meet. Excuse me then. Wait, wait, wait! I thought I should pretend I didn't see anything. So, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. Can you explain what it is this time you're doing? She's awkwardly put, awkwardly puts the small plushie she's been talking to on the desk. That isn't a familiar like Kotaro, is it? Okay, I see. However, that makes me all the more very worried about her. Sorry, 
Since I don't know any other familiars yet, I have no means to say so for sure. But it seems she's, he's a weirdo, even a senpai's eyes. Which makes what you did right now your hobby. Seems there's a reason for it. What kind of practice? Yeah, true. I recall what I saw yesterday when I visited the Wolfenage. I see, playing house, huh? my book, that's not something you need any practice for, though. Or so I thought, but then I play back in my mind what's what left Senpai's mouth when I came in. <laughs> I don't think that was any good. You know, it's yourself. As long as it's just doing practice, whatever is fine, I guess. <laughs> What's this reaction? Don't tell me. Do that in front of the kids? お母さんはそんな笑い方しないよって困らせてしまいました。this is about playing house, so I guess it's safe to assume those kids are still pretty small. What is she doing, thinking? She's gotta be just about the only person in the world who has ever told something like that. And that's why you've been practicing? I don't think there's a need to put so much effort into it. And what are you getting at with that declaration? No. I already thought something like that would follow. Okay, if I'm on me. I'll help you. Well, maybe. That's how you want to take it, that's fine. It's just that telling you my honest reason for wanting to help would be even more embarrassing. I don't know whether I can truly be do, uh, can be truly of help to her with something like this, but I want to do something for her. Every student council work comes first. Hi. Yeah. With the scheduled meeting over, we promptly call it, called it a day. After that, she invited me to her room, which is where I'm at right now. Ah, so is your room, huh? Why is this animal stabbed? Sorry. I basically never entered the room of a girl other than my family or the Ichi Norsa sisters, uh, so I'm all way a bit nervous when I don't even know. <sighs> Is it usually more disorderly? So, so na koto nai yo. Eri ni okorare nakutemo, chanto sozi suru shi. And the truth is, tamatama katazui te iru dake desu. Ah, go careful telling me the truth. <laughs> no. It's not like I'd particularly mind stroking her head, but if I simply do as she says, her demands are likely to escalate. But boy, I gotta say, there's a ton of plushies in here. <laughs> nah, not really. Oh, would that be a letdown to me anyway? I can't deny that my first impression of you was something like that, but uh... What can I say? You're just being you. Making you buy these kinds of plushies. 
What are these also gifts like those in the student council room? Murai mono mo aru kedo, hotondo wa ere no tezukri da yo. Huh? Handcrafted? Itte no kotta ke? Ere te, sai hou ga shimi na no. Sewing, which means. Uh, I think I got it. You mean the one who fixed that plushie you wrecked before was, uh. Ere ga yatte kure ta no. Motto taisit ni atska e te wa korare ta kedo. Let's see. That comes off uh, as a bit of a surprise. <laughs> Are they more on the no conanda yo? She looks at the plushies in her room with a gentle gaze. Seeing that, it makes me think that she must really love Eleno Eleonora. Sate, Ojaberi, Stenaide, Sorosoro, Hazimioka. Ah, sure. That being said, uh, what we're about to do is uh, now is also nothing but talking, basically. So, what do you do first when playing house? <laughs> Mm, makes sense. Can I be the father? Can I go home? Anyway, let's just do it. Shall we start with the from the point where I return home from work? Leave the room for a moment, then immediately open the door. Gotta be acting, I suppose. It doesn't really matter, I'll just be my usual self. I'm home. Just a little bit, what are you thinking about now? Eh? Every night, every night, I'm going to drink until I'm tired. Are you going to come back to home? Uh... Maybe... You're not going to be wrong, right? If you do that, I'm going to be wrong! Suddenly, I'm informed of our divorce. You're playing house here, aren't we? Sorry, Senpai, can we stop this right here? What? 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 Besides, when it comes to kids from an orphanage, this is seriously, really... There are kids with complicated family backgrounds here as well, so the worst case... Wouldn't it just possibly just dig up some drama? I really don't want to believe it, but you surely didn't already do this with the kids, did you? That's not the case, right? Now... I don't watch your comedy, just do it normally. That's it? Does that seriously strike you as strange? Anyway, do it the same as when you play with the kids. Huh? So the scene of me returning starts anew. I'm home. I think my face has a slight cramp, but let's ignore that for now. Stop. Eh? There's just so many things wrong with it that I'm getting a headache. Let me ask you, are cleaning the bath and cooking the husband's job? Yeah, true, but uh, what was the wife doing the whole day in this particular instance? Maybe the setting is that both husband and wife work? That's quite a nasty wealth. Also, was the continuation of the or maybe. Don't you think kids won't be able to understand that part? Is that expression of surprise genuine? I hope not. I see. I think I now have a pretty good understanding uh, for why the kids say you suck at playing house. No, to begin with, there is absolutely no need to add in jokes. Seems that she really didn't understand what was going on wrong from the very fundamental level. What you've been doing is not playing house, just but performing sketch comedy. You don't have to try to be funny, just do it seriously. I think that was quite the appropriate reasonable advice, actually, but uh, 
just have to act out a plain normal family, that's all. What's that? Sapai, for some reason she makes a troubled expression. えっとね、その、なんて言うのかな。普通の語家ってどういうのか、いまいちピンとこなくて。ああ。そっか、テレビのホームコメディとか、ああいうのは一般のお家とは違うんだね。Right, aside from being a normal human, she also didn't have the chance to grow up in a normal family. Not being a normal human. I'm sorry. Well, um... 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 Well, Did she just say hearth, hearths, and wood fire baths? But she's far more, far more older than I vaguely imagined. What?と先に言っておくけど、それがいつの時代なのかは聞いてはいけないよ。レディに年齢の話は禁物だからね。Granny, Granny. The next moment after she impishly sticks her tongue out at that. 100年前にはもういたわよね。Leave. <laughs> Leave! Fuck off! I don't want you any. Ah, that annoying guy again. Oi, Kora, so go no come on! I can't even hide the gun idea. You again? Do you have business with Senpai today? No, no. Daddy, ni ai ni kita ni kimatte ne shou. だったら私の部屋じゃなくて、ユウマくんの家に行きなさいよ。あ、俺にワンタイアイドだよ。だってだって、坊やの匂いがすると思ったな。お嬢の部屋じゃない。父くりって。ねえねえ、ダディ。年
Having arbitrarily thrown out all sorts of rude remarks, he disappears with the same suddenness as when he popped in. Um. Ah, yeah. I see. The thing is, after hearing an unbelievable number like a hundred years, I can't seem to care about n about now seemingly minor differences, like who of them is in fact el older. Yeah, what is it? If I challenge, you're talking about playing house? She seems really fired up of her. Oh no, it seems it seems that one person in the in like the retirement home died and she was actually a wonderful wife. How convenient! And so the next day after school. Oh, by the way, I hope you all realize that um Yes, this video is only like what three hours long. <laughs> Couple of with the video I recorded before this is now five hours. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
She asks that. As she asks that, she appears to have somewhat returned to her usual vibe. Well, I like cucumbers and eggs. So, I don't know if you want to eat it. Rice omelette, for instance. Ha! I don't know if you want to eat it. Yeah, I know, my bad. Gomen, gomen. But, I don't know if you want to eat it. I'm going 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 to eat it. Says, does she really mean? まあそれはおいおい練習しておくとしてそれじゃあ今夜は定番のカレーにしておくね、so、thought, あれユマくんなんで変わったのあれユマくんなんだか顔赤くあれユマくん I want to finish with that. that's the, really, really the case, but、uh, when I realized myself, that, then I realized myself that my face felt hot. What happened? At that, she approaches me with a worried expression and, uh. What? Just、uh, still absolutely stone faced. Senpai, um. My mind goes blank and I become un- unable to keep up with the situation. No, I, uh, our foreheads are touching each other right in front of me,、uh, her eyes. Yuma k u n Uh. The moment I finally grasp what she's doing, my face becomes all the more hot. More or less. I'm not sure if I'm going to be a good one. That's the continuation of our playing house! The sugary, sweet atmosphere that I'm exposed to makes my head spin. What is it? Someone's gonna walk in. Someone's gonna witness all of that. And both of them are just gonna be fucking embarrassed out of their mind. Eh? What? She fixatedly gazes into my eyes and. <sighs> oh wow! Finally done with that! How are you guys? Oh no! Yuku! Jinpo senpai! Tadai! ただいま戻りましたって二人とも何をしているんですかえっと何って何の話だね<笑><笑>ゆうユーマもなんでそんなに先輩と離れて突っ立ってるんだ No r e a s o n really No one the door was open we distanced ourselves from each other at lightning speed and moved to opposite edges of the room あれユウくん顔が真っ赤だよジンポー先輩もですね。Questioning, questioning gazes are poured onto us. However, it's during situations like these that Senpai's usual glibness becomes really useful. そ、その、なんていうかね。Well, that's what I thought at least. やば。無理無理。あ、あの、先輩。ちょっなんで涙ぐんでるんすかごごめん今日は私もう帰るねあー following that she immediately grabs her bag and stormed off、uh, stormed out of the room 朝ばくんゆうくんがジンポー先輩のことをいじめたのあ、uh, see ya、um, then what an excuse should I make? まっユーマごときに会長をいじめて泣かせられるとは思わないけどなどっちかっていうと逆だろそう、トスミアライフラインでも、それなら、なおさら…あさばくん、本当に何があったのてか、お前まだ顔が真っ赤だぞ I beg you, just pretend you didn't see anything. Unable to come with, up with a good excuse, I tied it over the situation by persisting in silence. Order. At night, I returned to my room. Ah, <sighs> やっと終わった 
While I was taking care of the kids, I somehow managed to pretend to be my usual self, but... Uh, <laughs> when I am alone, I sit down on the spot with a, th <laughs> with a thud. I'm getting nowhere, countless thoughts... <laughs> ah! Close to my mind, making my head spin. <laughs> what had occurred at the student council room has by now transformed into regret which closes in on me. Back then, I would have been countless excuses that could have varnished over the situation. Or just telling them the whole situation would have worked just as well. After all, it's not like I'm hiding the fact that I live in an orphanage, at an orphanage or anything. However, I couldn't do so. <laughs> I don't really understand myself. I, I don't really understand myself what it is I got so churned up about. At this point, pondering about this myself won't get me any further. <laughs> Slowly crawl up to the window of my room as I mutter that. And the wind, yep, in the window with her. Acting as a stand in the mirror, the glass reflects the figure of Ella, the other me. Me who is not me. As always, her attitude is blunt and gruff. Despite that, she always listens to whatever I want to talk about. Ella, what did you I... どうしてうまくやれなかったのかな知らん。そこ。だが、一般論を言えば。そうだな。私恥ずかしいことなんてしていないよ。子供たちと遊ぶ時の練習していただけだもの。恥ずかしいから、そんな理屈で己を騙していたのだろう。お前は。そんなことは。ま、私にはどうでもいいことだがな。ごめん。ま、become what I did there was not simply playing house. Maybe I... Then consequently, what... Consequently, what would that mean? Regardless of my circumstances, I actually fell in... そんなことより、ひなの件はどうなっているえお前の感情などより、そっちを先にどうにかするべきではないのか? The fact that she suddenly changed the topic probably means that she refused to answer my question itself. もう、真面目に聞いてよね。だから、私にはどうでもいいことだ。まったく。あんな男の何を気にする必要がある。大体アンは昔から我らの so, while ignoring the lecture L started, uh, I did not, but, no, nothing but puff up my cheeks and pout. Said so morning during the second half of the golden week, the weekends. I should stop, but I don't want to. <laughs> On that day, Aoi was out to oversee a, an away match for a sports club, and Konami met up with friends from a class. I was by myself, but... Hello? Oh, yuma the doorbell rang, so I answered the intercom, and what I then heard was quite a familiar voice. I'll open the door. Thereat, as I opened the entrance door, Jinpo steps in. Morning, Senpai. Mm, oh, hello. Ah, it's okay. So, what is it? あ、ティナちゃん発見。コタちゃんもヤッホー。お久しぶりでございます。アンサマ。ねえねえ、ティナちゃん、キュッてしてもいい？スリスリさせて。うっ。
ブユユーマさん This is yourself from Senpai who is sidling up to her in panic. Nina, Tina takes refuge behind my back. Did you come to toy with Tina? Stogiki wa roi no. Semete, Tina chan to asobi ni kita te itte? And naturally set my mouth as it seemed like you're all ahead. Full sails to treat her as your toy, so、uh, what did you really come here for? Dakara, Tina chan to asobi ni kita no. Just for that? Mm, so れだけだよ So she says, Sure, no, I know. Ja, Shoga, no, I c a a t you, my kunde, a so. See, I'm mercilessly treated as a backup toy, huh? I see, I'm, mer- I'm mercilessly treated as a backup toy, huh? But, anyways, it really seems like she just came for fun. I know, I know, I'm s o m e Huh? Kota chan, do you know? What a she did, she did.抱きしめられるのもスリスリされるのも大歓迎でございますよ。Get the horny bat。コタちゃんは別にいいや。なんか目つきがやらしいし。そんなこんなにもアン様好みの姿だというのに。確かに見た目は嫌いじゃないけど、なんか趣味じゃないというか、うん、中身がコタちゃんだから。It appears Senpai is also aware of the fact that Kotaro is actually a pervy dog. Well, considering the fact that he's seen as familiar while Senpai is her guardian, as both sexes assume they know each other rather well. Ah, now I get it. Huh? Yuma kun, nani? You said you came to play with her, but in truth you came to see how she's doing, right? <laughs> Bari chata? Why,、well, I don't think you have enough free time to justify swinging by for the sole purpose of having fun. Ere ga ne? Snao ni so to a iwanai kedo. Ya っぱり Tina chan no koto ga shinpai みたいなんだよね Watashi wa genki na no de, o k a e l i kudasai. Ah, so so. O m i a g e ni keki k a t e k i t a no. Keki d e s k a Kono mama m o t e k a e t e Hitori de tabe chata ho ga ii? O m i a g e da ke, o i t e itte kudasai. Tina, that's just shameless. I lightly flick Tina's forehead. I don't know, Yuma. So, 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 At any rate, I escort the senpai to the living room and make her tea. Ano Yuma san, keki wa. It's almost time for lunch, be patient until afternoon tea. Dama sare mashita. Ah, can't you even wait for a few hours? I'll give you a slice for your lunch dessert then. Shikata ga nai desu ne. Sore de te o uchimashou. As we have this exchange in our usual fashion. Ne, Kota chan. Hai. なんでございましょうユーマくんとティナちゃんっていつもこんな感じさようでございますね。厳しくしつけているようでただあまでございますよね。<笑>なんか見てて和むわ。今は doesn't look that way, I'm having quite a hard time here because her former guardian didn't properly discipline her. しつけの担当はエレの方だし、私は愛情を注いで可愛がる担当だったのよ。It strikes me that you're adoring is rather problem written too, though. どういうこと ?I think it's quite evident based on how Tina acts, but、uh, apparently she herself hasn't realized it. そんなことより、ユーマさん、ユーマさん。What is it, Tina? And refutation of her claims that she is supposedly a daughter. Tina basically ignores her completely and only talks to me. I dare to assume she went overboard with her adoring in a similar fashion to how she wrecked that plushie. Okay, then, uh, said bye if you'd like. Are you going to get it? No, no, no. What is it you're seeing? I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. So she suddenly proposes. Well, 
Sorry, it's just that I can hardly imagine you being able to cook. Shikena! But at school, you always just buy bread or paste pastries at the school store for lunch, don't you? Hora, Jibun no bento da ketskuru no te munashi de shu? Dakara, ito. Kota chan, nanto ka ite agete yo! So de gozaimasu ne. Ichio, hito tori no koto wa o deki ni naru to kyoku ste orimasu ga. Hora, Kota chan mo ko ite ryo? Ansa. お料理は美味しいですよ。お料理だけは。ティナちゃんも私の味方。My ears, it's quite blatantly. To my ears, it quite blatantly sounded like she was implying some kavit, though. え、気のせいじゃない ？I don't exactly get it, but it seems Tina can't really approve of senpai's during senpai preparing lunch. というわけで、嫌じゃなければ久々に腕を振るっちゃうけど。It's not like I have anything against it, but if you plan on demanding something from me in return, tell me in advance. Seriously? And that would be? Seems it's already pointless to try and stop her. Alright,、uh, here's what you want. If there's anything you're missing, I'll go buy it. Mm, I'll go buy it. I'll go buy it. So we end up having Senpai prepare our lunch today. And after waiting for not as much as 20 minutes, with skillfulness that renders me speechless just by looking, she brings over the food she prepared from the, uh, uh, from the kitchen. It's everything he said during the fucking playing house. Practice. It's omelet, a rice omelet with cucumber and, and what's the other, what was the other thing? He said. Nah,、uh, can't check back. Hi, o m a t a s e Kanta na mono de warike do ne? No, it's more than enough. So you've really prepared a proper meal? I find myself somewhat perplexed as I look at the plates with food lined up on the table. Comarimashta. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
so good that I even feel a bit perplexed. When we practiced playing out the other day, I already thought so too, but... Huh? It's sort of vexing to admit, but I think you could become a good bride. Huh? Response to what I said to her, she frees up for a moment and gives me a blank stare. あ、えっと、いきなりそんなこと言われても、で、なんで悔しがる必要があるの？We're great. I'd be grateful if you decided uh, between getting embarrassed or and getting upset. あの、にこまることは言わないで。もう、これだから元賞金首は brings back memories. I'd already completely forgotten that there was once a bounty on me. After that, another couple of seconds passed with her apparently unable to decide on how she should deal with this, but then... Can I take you up on that offer? I thought it'd be more fun to play along once in a while. I know that. I gaze at the rare sight of Senpa being flustered for real, despite the fact that she herself was the one who brought it up. I caught myself thinking that she's really cute. Yuma-kun, それ... Huh? What? Smile? すっごく優しい感じに笑ってた。もしかしたら初めて見たかも。これでもう一歩ミオちゃんとコナタに近づけたかな。I'm <laughs> pretty sure you've already uh not just caught up to them, but fucking blasted past them. What do you have to do with us? だって私だけユウマくんのちゃんとした笑顔を見たことなかったから、ちょっぴり悔しかったんだよ。さあ、ねえねえ、もう一回笑って。1+1は。え、you Edit her face right now, my face would most likely fire up from embarrassment. Salad is also good. But anyways, did I really smile naturally before her? What kind of meaning would that have? Could it be that she's the person who can make me smile? It's basically that felon. I continue with the my meal while doing my utmost to somehow keep my agitation from showing on my face. Like, <laughs> he's just like, hold up. Uh, I don't like it. Uh. <laughs> After lunch, we cleaned the house together. Of course, I told you she didn't have to do that, but when she, she asked me about my plans for the Mars, she said she'd help me when I answered her question truthfully. I already knew it, but situations like these really make it strike home that she won't listen once she has her mind set. <sighs> Really sorry about this. だから気にしなくていいってば、どの道今日は丸ごと予定を開けてあったんだから。Spending uh, a precious holiday with housework at someone else's place isn't exactly the most natural thing, if you ask me. 残念ながら本来の目的は果たせなかったけど、リナちゃん結局出てきてくれなかったしな。now that you mention it, you, you came because of Tina, huh? Sempe was supposed to be our guest, is helping out with housework, and she is. Want me to drag her out? But... Not so. On one hand, I feel bad about it, but on the other hand, a part of me thinks that I might actually have to thank Tina if this means Sempe is gonna visit again. Cake. Yeah, okay. Really, thanks for everything. どういたしまして。じゃあまた学校でね。I saw her off the entrance, at the, to the entrance after she got ready to leave. 
Now then, standing in the entrance hallway after Senpai left, I shortly ruminate about what I should do now. Uh, no. Tina? You were there? As if to make sure that Senpai is no longer here, she approaches me with rest while restlessly looking around. Don't worry, she already went home. But you know, she came to see you. She should at least have said goodbye. Sumimasen. Seeing that she looks despondent, I suppose she may also think that she did something bad herself. What is it? Well, it's only natural since she didn't have lunch. Are you fine eating with sen what Senpai prepared? Also, I've cried rough, huh? Spilling a wry smile in front of Tina's as uh, response to Tina talking big, I head towards the kitchen. Simply reheat her meal and also start to prepare tea with the idea of serving her a slice of cake, a cake afterwards. They're at... Yuma-san. Tina calls me with a somewhat hesitant vibe about her. Huh? You called me? Man, which was just about to pour hot water into the teapot, freezes. No, there really isn't anything like that between us. Yeah, not yet, at the very least. I catch myself lining up that excuse in my mind, and become churned up as to why there is a need to compliment that. Oh, talking aside, but just empathetically, I was in love with her. But I get the backing of the love fairy at that time. Uh, I carefully ask her as if to test the waters, but... Eh? Why? She isn't such a scary person as you believe. I look at the two of them, it was also pretty clear to me that Tina, even though she is avoiding Senpai, doesn't seriously dislike her. Then why... Demo. Tina speaks up, disrupting my words, in order to present a certain piece of reality before me. It was already late at night when I finished talk, take care of the kids. I heave a small sigh upon returning to my room. At that moment... Eren, what? Ella addressed me in my mind. It's not like we can't simply talk as is, but... Since it's naturally more comfortable to talk when you actually see the other, I go over to the window. Whoops. I don't really get it, but it seems I'm suddenly getting lectured. <笑>どういうつもりって言われても何の話昼間のことだ。よもや本気ではあるまいな。本気って何がなぜティナを連れ戻さない その上、あいつの居候を口実にするなどと言っていたではないか。おう、また遊びに行くってやつ。貴様は時々冗談と本気の区別が曖昧になるからな。確かに半分くらい本気で言ってたかも。ああ、貴様。大丈夫だって。半
as she asks me about that. As she asks me that, I ponder for a bit. What do I actually think of you, Ma? To be honest, hora, kawaii じゃない？まったく同意しかねるな。え、kawaii よ。悪趣味にも程がある。It appears there is no chance for us to come to an agreement in regards to this. でもほら、それに約束したからね。<laughs> 幸せにしてあげなくちゃでしょ。So it's not his dad that she reached, but his mom. That's a promise from long ago in the past. A promise I made with a very important person, telling me. <laughs> メオトにでもなるつもりか。えっと、そういうのじゃなくて。だ、マーチ starts to be a bit strong。私の目には惚れているようにしか見えないかな。な、何言ってるの？まったく。だだ。だったらどうなのだ？好きではないのか？そ、そういう。ストレートな言い方は。This is bad. This is basically the same as admitting it. <笑> Isn't this basically the same as admitting it? だからね、あの要するに私は。だだだ。Night is beating so fast. There's no way to cover it up anymore. 少し落ち着け。Crap, crap. Ella can easily sense what's going on in our body, just like I am. あ,あ。私は賛成できないぞ。Contrast to my heart, feverishly beating as if it's on fire, my mind is cooling down. 私はお前の悲しむ顔など見たくない。大丈夫。わかってる。Right, as a matter of fact. Really, must not truly experience love. この私が本気になんてなるわけないでしょ。Deny my rapidly beating heart while forcing a smile. It's giving me fucking depression. It's giving me clinical depression. もしも好きな人ができたとしても結ばれてはいけない。それが私たちの決まりだものね。そうだ。なぜなら我らは。ガザラナイル。死神だから。ね。Like I'm going to guess here. This is just going to be a fucking guess. But while she's like an actual boar and a half reaper, half human. He's like became a half reaper, half human, due to the life that he was given, and that's gonna be how they're gonna be able to get together. Something happens that for like he's never even thought about the fact that ah yes maybe he has a reaper soul in him. From that time, he almost died, so he's not even gonna have thought about like actively like trying to draw upon some kind of power like that. But some kind of situation is gonna arise. Where they're in trouble, and he's just accidentally gonna like, ah yes, wings and the scythe, and that's how they're gonna find out, and everything is gonna be happy, or none of that is gonna happen, and it's just clinical depression. Because clinical depression is uh turns out very very common in games. I mean, I'm away. That this apparently isn't a Utsuge, so I don't have to worry about that. Because I'm pretty sure an Utsuge would actually cause me to suddenly hang from the ceiling back there, which is、uh, less than optimal. So, anyways, uh, I'm actually in the part now, so it's like what <laughs> two in the morning. <laughs> Help! I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and see you next time. Bye bye.